<sighs> Hello. Can you hear me? People are saying rip, so I guess not. Oh, hello! Good to see you. How are you, everyone? Jesus, lots of support coming in. As always, before I even arrive, you're just having a great time. <laughs> Lord of the Fox, thank you for the five subs earlier. Uh, Ellis, thank you for the two subs. Radcath, Kendra, Summer Breeze, Lonnie, Julia, Ellis, and Marmillion, thank you so much for the ten subs. That is very kind of you. Thank you so much for the support. Uh, Becky, Rana, Mr. Zeapple, Lily, uh, Fioli, thank you very much, everyone. It's good to see you. I know, I'm on time as heck, right? Pretty nuts. <laughs> I, uh, to be fair, I'm usually pretty on time. It's just people give me shit if I'm even 30 seconds late. <laughs> so I have a reputation for being late. <laughs> when I think the latest I've been streaming, like, the past two or three months, other than, like, hospital visits and such was like two minutes <laughs> like on a regular day <laughs> that's like the latest i've been eve Rizzle, thank you very much for the subs there as well you're very kind but anyway enough about me how are you doing everyone it's good to see you here i'm i feel out of frame i feel very low he's towering over me up there because well, I've got, um, I was five minutes late once. Oh, <laughs> uh, what was it going to say? Yeah, he's towering over me, but I haven't set up for the next, um, the next scene, the in-game stuff. Uh, I was trying to figure out the best format for it. Um, feck allergies. I know. Oh, allergy season's been bad here. I don't know how that works. Like, is it countrywide or like just our locale or what? But Jesus, it's been brutal. Like, even I went downstairs a while ago just to be like, hey, I might take a little a little sit down downstairs, you know, just stare at the walls, like different walls, because I'm usually staring at these. And even then, my allergies got pretty bad. How to vote? We haven't even started yet. I'll let you know. Don't worry, you will have your say. <laughs> this is going to be an interesting one. <laughs> I don't know why I really have headphones on. This is, uh, is this needed? Probably not, right? I feel naked without them, though. I guess I don't need them. Right? I feel weird. Is this weird? <laughs> Are we ready for this? <laughs> Nick, thank you very much for the five subs. Very, very kind of you. Thank you so much. Really appreciate that. Uh, Undead Gore, Heart Rate, The Drunken Irish, Katie. Uh, congrats on the second dose. I'm getting mine this time next week. So uh, hopefully, uh, hopefully that I'll be able to stream this time next week. Um, but yeah, I hope you're feeling all right. Um, side effects got to you a bit. I hope you're better now. Lonnie, thank you for the bits as well. We're going to end up giving you a lifelong complex about be, <laughs> being on time to things. To be fair, I'm pretty punctual normally anyway, so I kind of already had it, luckily enough. Leon Music, thank you for the sub. Appreciate that. Vampire Heart, Skybo, Snow Keith, Dragon, Marajax, uh, Local Ghost, Jacob, I'm Just Bored, Lotus, uh, Creamy. Uh, a rat named Mr. Brungy, Lord Pancreas, Error, uh, Silvera, Zay, thank you for the bits. Ah, I hope your foot's okay. Sounds sore. A uh, meat stiletto, also sounds sore. Thank you for the gifted sub. Louis Copeland, Sloth, uh, Mallory, Kyle, Marion, Chillzone, Jazzer, uh, Minev, Malcolm, Denku, Verber, uh, Amaruza, Nuclear Toast, Darwinna, uh, Nick, Alien, Spit Queen, Ozzy, Lexi, Akido, Giraffe, Ash, and Telexa. Thank you for the subs. Welcome, everyone. Please do more Sims 2 videos. Oh, don't worry. I'm uh, I'm pretty addicted to the Sims 2, so I'm pretty sure that's a certainty. And I already have the next two episodes planned. The next one's going to be possibly the darkest thing I've ever done in the Sims, I think. <laughs> so that's going to be an interesting one. I'm already looking forward to playing it. I actually had that idea before the cat idea, but I was like, I don't think I can follow the next one with cats. This one is much worse, so I have to do the cats first. <laughs> it made more sense. <laughs> uh, John Doe, Natalie, Roadkill, Local Ghost, Ramelli, uh, Clowers, thank you very much. Call me Chayton. Thank you for the three subs as well. Very, very kind of you. Local Ghost, enjoy work as much as you can anyway. Oof. <laughs> yeah. He was just like, oh no, what's going to happen? What could it be? Tony Baloney Pepperoni, thank you very much for the 25 subaronis. 
That's very, very kind of you. I always love the name. It just rolls off the tongue. Tony Baloney Pepperoni. Uh, thank you so much for that, honestly. You're always very supportive. I very much appreciate it. Thank you. Thank you very much. Uh, Sierra, Sky, Kays, Ramelli, thank you very much. You're very kind, folks. I really appreciate it. Thank you so much. I'm glad you're, um, you're hyped about The Sims 2, though, because it's weird. I was even talking to someone about it, and it was like, it's weird that you can do Sims 2 and people actually enjoy it, given it's so old. But I was like, I think it's just the quirkiness of it. Like, The Sims 2 is bizarre. Like, everything about it. My guy is obsessed with grilled cheese. His life goal is to eat grilled cheese. I got impregnated with alien babies. <laughs> and my cats work full-time jobs. Like, <laughs> the wackiness of it just can't be matched. <laughs> Uh, K's, Sky Blue, Ramelli, Lockhart, uh, Shay, Urta Maggie, M Dog, Pancake, Emma, Tony Baloney, Pepperoni, thank you for the sub as yourself as well, the seven months. And Ian, thank you very much for the five subs. That is very, very kind of you. Thank you very much. Friendly, Denny, thank you very much for the sub. You are very friendly. I appreciate it. Uh, we'll get started in about two minutes. I'm just giving people a chance to, to join. I don't do like a starting soon. I don't do like a countdown starting soon uh, screen, so <laughs> so I, I usually just come on and chat to people, give people a few shout outs and whatnot. <laughs> I literally read it as it was saying, uh, <laughs> I'd rather come on and just talk while we start rather than just waiting on a countdown. We'd all just be sitting there. <laughs> uh, Ashton. Roku, Amber, uh, Rolf, thank you for the bits. And congratulations on your bachelor's degree. Jesus Christ, I didn't even make it through secondary school. You're doing well. Jesus. Thank you for the kind words as well. Best of luck with everything. Uh, Betty, the kids in my basement. Thank you both for the subs. Cheerios, thank you for the five subs. <laughs> very, very kind. Uh, Guardian Angel, Mike, Dr. Grimmy, Triage, Magic, uh, Deep Brit Britannica, Mist. As some hurt, Gardy, uh, Afflicon, Evie, Tanker, thank you very much for the subs. Kays, thank you for the two subs. And Lilac, thank you so much for the five subs. You're very, very kind. Thank you very much, everyone. Um, I appreciate it. I'm going to do a tweet now. And I think we'll be good to go in about a minute. Excited. Exciting times. You play a bit like five hours every day. Well, hopefully you can help me then because my people... My people are, um, they don't have the best luck. They're pretty unlucky. So I need someone's guidance, but mainly your luck, as I feel like my choices have been pretty good. A Hato Heart, a Flannel Socks, Leah, a the King Saro, Giddy, Koalara, and Becky Dodd, thank you very much for the, the 10 months as well. Jesus Christ. And Cherry, thank you for the 10 months. Jesus, within seconds of each other. And that's a coinky dink. Um, grief for Jesus. <laughs> if you spawn, grief for Jesus. Dwight Sage, thank you for the two subs. And Dance, thank you so much for the five subs. You're both very kind. Thank you very much. I appreciate it. Very, very kind. All right. Shall we get started? I think we're kind of good to go. Uh, yeah, that, that is a ton of subs. Thank you very much for the kindness, everyone. You're very, very kind. I think um, I think we're good to go. Uh, Dying Cloth, Ollie Gaming, Chrishella, thank you very much. Okay, what I'm going to do, um, I'm going to do the same thing as uh, last time um, for the stream. Just so, because I feel like I'm struggling to multitask more and more. So what I want to do is um, I want to thank everyone. Like at the at the start, like we were just doing. Everyone's super kind, super appreciated. Speaking of which, Kaza, Kate, uh, Mini Rose, Eve, thank you very much. Captain Court. And Space Kitten, thank you so much for the 10 subs. As I was saying, very, very kind. I appreciate it. <laughs> very nice of you. Um, but what I'm going to start doing for a bit anyway is trying to thank everyone. And then we do the game stuff. And we'll be playing game for like an hour and a half, two hours, whatever it might be during the stream. And then at the end of the stream, I'll thank everyone that I've missed. Um, I think it makes a bit more sense. Uh, Jesus Christ, Becky Dodd, thank you so much for that. <laughs> uh, thank you very much, Becky, for the 20 subs. Very kind, Space Kitten. Thank you again for the 10. Uh, but I think that kind of works because then it won't be me like looking at the polls, 
looking at the game, looking at the chat, looking at the notifications, trying to play the game as well. And it's just, you know, my brain, I've got two brain cells up there, so they're struggling. They can only cooperate so much. Uh, Emma, Alimba, Saturn, Arizona, Shady, 69, uh, Alien Boy Creations, Real Electric Gamer, Deanna, thank you very much. Becky, thank you so much again for that. And Demon Towser, thank you for the bits. Okay, so I've marked that. Uh, Jenny, Chris, thank you as well. Very kind of you. Uh, I've marked that. We're going to go over to the game and I will catch up. Ooh, big boy. Uh, uh, <laughs> I will catch up afterwards. Hey, no, no scream and play game in all caps. Have patience now. Be nice. It's the internet, but you should still be nice to each other. Um, yeah, we're going to get started and I will catch up on the rest of the alerts. When I come back, I'd like to need, thank you so much for the five subs. All right. Uh, I'm big now, so you got to be scared of me when I say that. Hey, hey, no all caps, ooga booga. All right, um, so what we're going to do, uh, here we go, put that up there. Yeah, no, everyone's really nice. It's just occasionally you get one person coming in. It's like, me want demand, you monkey, you dance for me. <laughs> like, no, 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 not how it works. Uh, right, so we're going to be playing BitLife. If you haven't pay played BitLife before, uh, I have played and paid for it. I'm a bit... Bitizen, they call it. Premium member. They don't just hand these out. I had to pay for it. I'm not actually that happy about paying for apps. I don't know what it is. Like on these freemium things, I'm just really stubborn. I don't know why. Because <laughs> it's like, oh, new release game, 60 quid. And then something like this, 5 euro, what? <laughs> but I could play for free. Um, but yeah, I'm a, I'm a Bitizen. We're going to be going through our lives. I have this poll, so this will pop up uh, like that. And you'll be able to vote uh, one through eight. I'm just going to get rid of that for now. Um, so it'll come up each um, each choice, and then you'll be able to choose what we do with the person's life. So we'll just design the person together because the first section where you actually make the person, you click on the little mouse, squeak, squeak, squeak. And okay. <laughs> We just got a random person. No, um, Miguel, sorry, I'm starting a new life. Uh, you're just, you're not my kind of baby, so goodbye. Okay, uh, right. Will we make me? Will we make me? Is it loud? Oh, sorry. Hold on, I don't have my headphones on. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Did you enjoy that ASMR? Sorry. 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 <laughs> Thing is, it doesn't make noises normally, so I have no way of gauging it until it happens again, so... Prepare your ears. No, I've I've over halved it, so hopefully that's okay. Okay, uh, what are we thinking? What are we thinking uh, for the name? The game is loud, but the, uh, there's no sound on at the moment. We gotta wait. Turg, enjoy the baby in it right here. There's nothing on, right? Yeah, there's no sound. Okay, it should be fine. Um, should make yourself. Shrek, Steven, St <laughs> Turg, hmm. How about like, um, oh, I got it. Failed, how do you spell this? Democracy? Democracy? That's right, right? Failed democracy. It's, it's kind of fitting, given what we're doing, I think. I like that. All right, we'll leave that where it is. Um, and start Fails Life. All right. This is Fails Democracy. <laughs> I was born a male. I was conceived on my parents' honeymoon. My birthday is 7th of December. I'm a Sagittarius. My name is Fail Democracy. My mother is Claire Democracy. My father is Noah Democracy. Noah Democracy <laughs> is also a pretty good name. Like, No Democracy, Noah Democracy. <laughs> All right, maybe I'm just enjoying that. We have a family mongrel named Jackpot. We are ugly as shit, unfortunately. Well, we just have to roll with that. <laughs> okay, so the first kind of years... Is that kind of okay? I'll just make sure the thing. The first years are kind of uneventful. I'm just going to put these on for a second. Um, but I'll give you the, the poll anyway. So in this instance, one, two, three. That's what you're voting on. One, two, three. So the other ones aren't relevant, but they're going to show up each time anyway. So you get to decide what to do. It's dinner time, and once again, your father's swirling a spoonful of your least favorite green muck through the air. The spoon approaches your lips. What will you do? 
One, slap the spoon. Two, eat it. Three, cry. You get what I mean. And it's quite close. So you just put in the numbers that you want to vote in chat. If you want to vote for the first option, put in one. If you want to vote for the second, put in two. The third, put in three. And then just hit enter. Your vote will be submitted. So it's looking like one has fittingly won. So we're going to be a bit of a brat and we're going to slap the spoon. There you go. Not a very uh, impactful <laughs> choice there because we are just, you know, one years old. Uh, but we'll age up a little bit and then we'll see. Um, okay, so your mother's taking you to the doctor's office to get vaccinated. How will you behave? One, throw a, con a conniption fit. Two, bite her. Or three, try to stay calm. Did her looks improve? Oh my god, we're growing. We went all the way from 1% to 3%. That's three times as good looking as we were before. Okay, so option two, bite her. Great. Uh, I think she still got us vaccinated, so at least there's that. Your parents had a baby. Okay, well... That's a little disappointing. They gave up on me pretty quick. Ah, well, you know what? That's fine. Uh, age up. We need to get to adult life till the choices get really, you know, impactful. Okay. Integrity. You broke your parents' thermostat while you were playing. What will you do? Eat her isn't an option. <laughs> you can't just eat her. <laughs> I can't just input a thing like eat. <laughs> and what do you mean eat her? Like my, my sister? <laughs> Is that what you're saying? I don't think that'll uh, fix the thermostat. I mean, it would definitely distract them from the fact I broke the thermostat. It wouldn't seem like a big issue. It would give the parents a little lesson in, I guess, what's important in life. But for now, we're just going to deny responsibility. It wasn't me. I broke my parents' thermostat and they lied about it. So these don't have like an immediate outcome. It's not like you lied, go to prison. But it does impact your overall like karma and what happens to you down the road um so keep that in mind but it looks like you just want them to be terrible so let's keep going i'm gonna try and get to uh adulthood as fast as possible while playing on the sidewalk outside of your home you notice a group of buzzing insects flying in and out of a nearby lamppost what will you do one observe them two disregard them three throw a rock at them well would you look at that Look at that poll, huh? <laughs> what a surprise. <laughs> For God's sake, <laughs> throw a rock at them. I threw a rock at a beehive outside of my home and was chased back inside by a swarm of angry bees. My looks has gone up to 5%, so there is... Ho it's gone down to 4 actually, as I said that. Never mind. Uh, okay. Your classmate, Bobby Sue, just came into class late and slammed the door. What'll you do? Ignore her antics. Report her to the principal, attack her, or laugh at her. I will warn you that attack her will probably result in serious consequences. Uh, it doesn't matter, I just looked at the poll. Okay, <laughs> attacking, attacking it is. I have a feeling this failed democracy is very, very literal uh, in terms of their name. Right, attack her. Oh, sweet Jesus. Okay, so let me start the poll here. So you got one slap, two roundhouse kick, three stamp, four punch, five backhand, or six tickle. What are you thinking? What kind of attack do you think you're 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 considering here? We are gonna die so fast. I mean, you're on a fast track to the graveyard. I'm gonna be honest with you. As a person who has also selected these options, I can tell you that now. <laughs> All right, we're going with two. So we're gonna round a roundhouse kick her. Uh, one tooth, two back, three groin, four nose, five shoulder, or six toes. What are we going to roundhouse kick? So far it's looking between her back or her toes. But it looks, oh no wait, groin is also, yeah groin is making its way up the pole. Uh, it's between groin and toes. <laughs> Bit of a weird sentence. <laughs> it's actually going towards toes. 
Okay, we are going to... Oh, oh, this is close. There's four votes in there. Okay, five, four, three, two, one, zero. Yep, toes. Okay, we're going to roundhouse kick her toes. Attack. Oh my god, we did so much damage. What? Oh no, <laughs> that wasn't good. Okay, so you get the options to boost these. So, what are you thinking? A relative gives you a gift certificate to a trendy hat store. You've been wanting to don a new lid recently. <laughs> what age are we? Aren't we like seven? <laughs> what seven-year-old goes, Hello, mother. I'd like to don a new lid, please. Uh, what will you do? One, give me that. Or two, I'm not really a hat person. It probably will boost our looks, by the way. And it can be whatever hat you want it to be. Maybe it could be a fedora. We could be fedorable. Milady. Or, you know, you could just condemn him to a life of ugliness. Nope. You're picking a hat. Great. Let's give him a hat. All right, failed democracy. You just got a hat. Look at that. <laughs> Amazing what uh, covering up some of the damage will do. Like, out of sight, out of mind. Our looks just quadrupled. All right. We're only seven. <laughs> I feel like they've been through a lifetime and a half already. All right, behavior. Your jackpot just tried eating a slice of pizza right out of your hand. What will you do? I think you get the point now. You can read it. Uh, at least I hope you can read it. And you can vote for what you want. You want to reward him for eating the pizza straight out of your hand. All right. I guess that's what a failed democracy does. It raises a bit of a brat when it comes to their dog. Like, that's... You're gonna you're gonna be pretty untrained there. He's gonna cause some issues. But I'll go with it. Reward him. <laughs> ah, he loved it. So not only did he eat your pizza, you then rewarded him by giving him some beef. Not the kind of beef I would expect if the dog literally steals your food. Your classmate Thomas has been dunking your head in the toilet every day. What do you do? <laughs> now, without looking at the poll, I would say we're going to report him to the principal because that is the responsible thing to do. Now let me slowly glance towards the pole. We're going to attack him. What a surprise. <laughs> All right, let's see why. <laughs> what are you thinking? What are you thinking for this? What kind of attack are we going to do? <laughs> I'll catch up with all those alerts um, when we're done with uh, BitLife, by the way. Thank you so much for being so supportive. Okay, it's looking like... Oh, this is a close one again. It's looking like two. Are we going for a bite? Oh, no, wait, hold on. Is it a bite? All right, I'll just end it and see what we get. Yes, it's bite. Okay, bite. This is going to go so badly. All right. Where are we going to bite? Me want to bite. <laughs> Do you want to bite his lip? <laughs> you do want to bite his lip. Is it like in a in a crush kind of way? Maybe that's why the bully's picking on us. Because they're, they're like crushing on us hard. And we're going to crush his lip. Okay, that's pretty decisive that it will be bite his lip. How cute. Oh no. <laughs> They then gave you a... Oh, wait. You bit the bully's lip. Then you gave him a swift kick to the thyroid gland. Jesus Christ. All right. Let's keep going. I'll, oh, no. Jackpot's dead. Jackpot's dead. Jackpot's dead. Oh. Well, at least we gave him that pizza and that beef like a year ago. We were a good owner. Uh, I'm starting to think my mother is a fan of Tyler the Creator. Okay, um, that's sad. Maybe we should maybe we should treat old failed democracy to something. All right, let's. Uh, wait, actually, maybe the things don't really open. When we're 18, we'll treat them. You just gotta wait eight years, and then we'll treat them to something nice. Uh, what are we gonna do at the pool party? Gotta get that happiness up, and we do. To be fair. And looks. We need to look better and we need to feel better. Um, what are we going to do? Go fully clothed. Okay. Okay. Let's go fully clothed. I went to a pool party but kept all of my clothes on. 
It's a good note for the diary. All right, we got to speed up here. We got to we got to get to 18 to cause some real real chaos. Are we going on holiday? Complain but go is kind of winning. Oh, we're undecided. Be appreciative. Refuse to go. Oh god, this poll's all over the place. This is the most divisive one yet. Good thing we have democracy. Otherwise, I'm not sure how we'd uh, we'd pick this. Two. All right. Complain but go. We still enjoyed it. All right. Exam ethics. What is this? Your classmate Bobby Sue tells you that she's going to fail your history teacher. Teacher Mrs. Es Espinosa's class, unless you let her chief ch cheat off of you on the upcoming exam. What will you do? Let her cheat off me, report her to the principal, help her study instead, refuse to help her. Report her to the principal. What a good friend. <laughs> we don't even just say no, we just, we, we, we snitch on our friend. Great. All right, high school time. What is it? Habitat for Humanity. Some friends that you're starting high school with are encouraging you to join Habitat for Humanity with them. What will you do? One, join the group. Or two, I'm not interested in that. I'm not interested in that. Looks like it's winning. Okay. I'm just going to speed through here. We got four more years to go before we're a fully grown adult. And then we can start getting jobs. Start causing a little bit of chaos, you know? Um, right, what do we want to do? While in your math teacher's class, Mrs. Handy's class, your classmate, Ad Adjurin, all of a sudden begins ripping pages out of the class textbook one at a time, yelling less is more with each new page tear. What will you do? Surprise, surprise, we take this personally and we attack them for some reason. <laughs> the attacking ones are pretty entertaining, to be fair. <laughs> Quite the combinations. What sort of attack do you want to do, chat? Do you want to twist, stretch, punch, kick, squeeze, scratch? It sounds like the worst version of Bop It ever. What are you thinking? Punch? I think it's punch. Okay. You want to punch... And where would you like to punch? His ear, his nose, his chin, his face, or his forehead, or his arm? What are you thinking, huh? Hmm. Five is winning pretty hard. His forehead? You want to punch his forehead. It's good. It's good. It's a good, a good area. It's a big target. Attack. You punch your classmate's forehead, then you bit his heel, leaving a bite mark. We always go for weird spots with the bites. Oh no! Our father died at a young age of 15. I shouldn't even need to ask this, because of course we'll attend his funeral. But do you want to, one, attend his funeral, or two, skip the funeral? I mean, sure, you didn't seem to mind when the dog died, but when the father died, I'd assume you'd... What? You're not going? <laughs> what a surprise! <laughs> Skip the funeral. <laughs> what do you now? It's the important choice. Do you want to take your driving test? <laughs> Jesus Christ! One or two. Take the test or no? Maybe some that you want to take the test. I'm not sure. Well, I guess I'll just take the test. I'll try my best on it. All right, finish poll. Take the test. Uh, what does this road sign mean? I rode narrow skinny cars only. I didn't realize it was one of these. Okay, chat. Tell me, what does this road sign mean? I thought it was going to be a timed thing I'd have to do, but this is your driving test. What do you think? One lane ahead? Mm. Road narrows? Mm. Or skinny cars only? Mm. Well, it seems like the majority think skinny cars only. Jesus, you wouldn't want you guys as, like, the, the audience and who wants to be a millionaire, would you? <laughs> we failed. Okay, what is this? Your mother has married your new stepfather, Eb Ebenezer Wright, a 67-year-old retired restaurant worker. They went to the Great Wall of China for their honeymoon. I have a new stepsister who's 42 years old. Stepfather title? What will we be causing, uh, calling our new stepfather? Dad, Sir, Ebenezer, or bro. What's up, bro? <laughs> I wouldn't go to your funeral either, bro. What a horrible child. 
All right, we're calling dad bro, apparently. You are suffering from depression. Now that clicked in. All right, that's what pushed us over the line. Calling our dad bro. Bit of a weird one. Okay, but this is good news, because even though we're depressed and we look just awful, we're now an adult. What are we going to do with our life, chat? We can A, look for a job. Sorry, one, look for a job. Two, apply to university. Or three, take some time off. You won? No, this is just the start. Like, you passed, you, you graduated. So you're already doing better than I did in my life, if you put it that way. But we still, like, we have more life to live. What do you want to do? Three? You want to take some time off. Okay. <laughs> All right. <laughs> What do we do now? <laughs> okay, activities. Let's, I'll start here. I'll just go into random menus. That's probably the best way to do it. Start poll. What do you want to do with our time off? You got eight choices there. Bear in mind that certain things like adopt the child, it just won't work. They won't give it to us because of our, um, because of our age. So, one seems to be winning. Find love. Oh... No, that was short-lived. It's uh, crime. Crime is now winning. Let's get shredded at the gym. I think that'd be a great idea, Iron Gen, but it seems like crime is on the agenda, unfortunately. <laughs> unfortunately for this failed democracy. <laughs> uh, all right, what are we doing now? One, two... Oh, we can't do that. So, I guess three, four... No, 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 no. we'll say if it's grayed out, it still counts, so... One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. What are we going to do, folks? Pickpocket is winning at the moment. Closely followed by bank robbery. <laughs> it's quite the choice, isn't it? It's like, I feel like doing some crime, but I just can't decide between pickpocketing or robbing a bank. <laughs> okay. Oh, no. Murder's winning. Oh, Jesus. Okay. That escalated. I guess we went with option C. Yep. Merger is kind of uh, making its way up the pole. You sure you don't want to do anything else? You sure you want to go right to murder? You really want to murder someone? Okay. Yep, you do. I just looked over and I saw the pole like trickling up. Okay. Murder it is. I, just, just to be sure, that's what you want. Because I feel like I, there must be some mistake. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yeah, that's... That's murder, alright. Okay. I didn't think this is what you had in mind when you said you wanted some time off. <laughs> when we were given the option. Okay. This is a weird question, but who would you like to murder? God's sake. Stephanie Democracy, Savannah Democracy, Ebenezer Wright, bro. Amanda Wright, uh, Claire Wright, or a random neighbor is the last one, I think. God, you really have it out for bro, don't you? It turns out we're actually not that much of a bro. We're saying it, but we didn't mean it. It wasn't like bro, it was bro. Okay, well, I guess we're going to attempt to kill our stepfather then. What method do you want to use? I'll, I'll fill you in on a little secret from my experience. Pushing them off a cliff is the most likely one to get away with it. So let's see what you do. One, strangle them. Two, scare to death. Three, impale them. Four, fastball to the head. Five, push off cliff. Or six, club them. Okay, it looks like you are trying to push him off a cliff. That's good. Well, closely followed by scared to death. Given how awful a person looks, maybe a simple boo would suffice. I don't know. We'll see. Is it actually winning? Okay. It is looking like we're going to push him off a cliff. All right. One, two, three, four, five. Just making sure. Push off cliff. Okay. You pushed your stepfather off a cliff while he was admiring a scenic view. He died. Okay, you did kill him. You succeeded with 
The murder. <laughs> Sorry, bro. Did we get caught? Uh, okay, your stepfather, Ebenezer, Ebenezer Wright, was murdered. Do you, one, attend the funeral or two, skip it? <laughs> People survive that? I think you can fail in the murder attempts. Like, they could, you know, not be pushed off and stuff like that. Uh, okay, we're attending his funeral, weirdly enough. I don't know, is failed democracy just getting a sick, twisted thrill out of this? Because <laughs> we skipped our father's funeral, which seemed to deeply impact us. Not as much as calling our stepfather bro, which led to depression. Um, but we are attending the stepfather's funeral, who we hated and we killed. Attend the funeral. Well, we got away with it somehow, so congratulations on uh, getting away with murder, everybody. You did great. Can we get uh, a little pog in the chat? Maybe tap each other on the back. Just good job. I tend to laugh at his grave. <laughs> so that's why we're going. <laughs> I'm imagining like a Nelson laugh. <laughs> All right. I guess what I'll do every year, I'll give you the choice of doing something. It's probably the best way. So, uh, university. We, we can go to university or you can pick something else. I mean... You already had your time off. I don't know if you want more time off. I don't know. Do you have other things that you want to do with your life? Like, was your bucket list just kill stepfather? Or was there more to it that you want to take care of before you... Okay, you want to enlist in the military. <laughs> it doesn't sound good for, like, a murderer to join the military. I don't know if he has the temperament, but... You've made the decision. He's enlisting in the military. <laughs> What branch of the military would you like him to join? <laughs> defend the land, defend the air, defend the sea, attack the beach, or defend the homeland. What are you thinking? You're thinking three? <laughs> Why do I get the feeling that you're just thinking about the navy as in, like, the village people? Young man, there's no need to feel down. I said, bro's dead, and you got away with it. Yeah, what are we going with? Oh, oh, no, that actually put you off. You want to attack the beach now. <laughs> okay. Uh, Voxy, thank you so much for the subs. As I said earlier, I'll catch up with those, um, uh, with those alerts again at the end of the stream, or at least after bit life, whenever that might be. But thank you for that, Voxy. Okay. Marines, attack the beach. Uh, I guess we have to enlist in the Marines, right? I mean... Yeah, I, I'll just enlist the Marines because we won't get the other one. You were being arrested by the police. In hindsight, after committing a murder, it probably wasn't the best idea to enter the military and probably have our background dug into. Uh, but here we are. What are we going to do? Are we going to cooperate or are we going to run for it? <laughs> we were, We got away with murder, but no, you were just like, hey... Let's join the military. Let's get our background thoroughly checked. In fact, take some of my DNA when you're at it. You know when you're shaving my head, the buzz cut you give me? Just keep all of my hair, just in case you come across anything. Might be a good idea. Okay, we are going to run away. Run for it. You were caught, so now it's even worse. Okay, so you know when you decided earlier to not get a job and to take some time off? We have no money to uh, get a defense team together. So I guess we'll just get a public defender. Uh, oh my god, we might be sentenced to death. The judge has asked you to make a plea surrounding your charge for murder and running from the police. If you plead guilty, you may receive a shorter sentence than if you were convicted in a trial. How will you plea? Possible sentence is death. Do we plead guilty, not guilty, or no contest? <laughs> YOLO. I mean, yes, YOLO, but <laughs> also YOLO, <laughs> you know. <laughs> uh, okay, no contest. That's what you're going for? Okay, 
No contest it is. You've been convicted of murder and running from the police and sentenced to 43 years in prison. <sighs> oh no. Okay, so as we were saying earlier, every year you get a choice of what you want to do. So let's age up and... Oh no. <laughs> what is this? You hear that an inmate who was just released after serving a long sentence for 60 DUIs was killed by a drunk driver on the way home from prison. What will you do? Laugh at the irony or cry about it. After this, I'll go into the menu and you can decide what you want to do. Laughing at the irony. Jesus Christ. <laughs> that is so dark. <laughs> Good Lord. And that is really one-sided. Like, I put that on the level of not attending your father's funeral. <laughs> but okay. Maybe not quite at that level, I guess. But let's laugh at the irony. Okay. Oh, good news. My little sister Savannah is no longer suffering from diarrhea. I just love that they continue to send me mail when I'm in prison. It's good to keep up to date with all the news of the family, you know. That's great. Okay. Um... So, let's see. We'll go here. So, what what would you like to do? Start poll. One, we can go into sentence. Two, appeal. Three, bribe. Four, conjugal visit. We don't even know another human being other than our family. So, that is grayed out. <laughs> Five, cry. Six, escape. Seven, join a gang. Or eight, seek medical attention. What are you thinking? You're thinking of crying. <laughs> That's what you want to do right now. It's kind of what I want to do too, to be honest with you. It's been a sad life. <laughs> One, two, three, four, five. Yes, you do. You just want to have a nice cry. Okay. Let's have a little cry. Are you sure you want to cry in prison? Yes. You sat and bawled in the corner of your cell. Fortunately, no one noticed. Okay, that's been an eventful year. All right, so... um. We've obviously been feeling a bit of pain. While hanging out in the prison yard, another inmate asked you if you'd like a hit of morphine. What will you do? <laughs> hit me or get away from me. That's one or two. What are you thinking? You want a bit of morphine? Or you want to you wanna get out of here? No one noticed us all year. We were literally crying for an entire year and no one noticed us. You're right, Flower. It's kind of sad. <laughs> Maybe it was tears of happiness. It's, I'm so glad bro is dead. <laughs> Alright. We're taking a hit of morphine. I tried morphine. Stephanie has been promoted to lieutenant and Savannah graduated from high school. I tried morphine. <laughs> That's how my day is going. Uh, let me move the pole just slightly. It's slightly overlaid there. There you go. Just a little bit cleaner. I might... Yeah, there we go. Okay. Um... Did I age up? No. We cried last year. Yes, that was it. Sorry. The time kind of all molds together when you're in prison. Okay, prison. What do you want to do? One through eight. <clears throat> Remember, conjugal visit is not available as nobody loves us. What's up next? Hello, Liam. You want to join in? We're in prison for murdering our stepdad, bro. <laughs> Look how angry failed democracy looks. <laughs> he looks so pissed off. Ah, oh, classic Sagittarius. <laughs> <laughs> Poor failed democracy. Oh, it's sad. Okay, what are we doing? One, two, three, we're doing six. We're gonna attempt to escape. Okay, fantastic. We're back. I'll try and do this. Okay. Okay, so the thing about this is, you gotta, so it's kinda, it's kinda hard to explain. He'll only make moves towards you, and will try to walk horizontally first. So it's kind of a puzzle. But because I'm playing on PC, I can tap it pretty fast, luckily enough. I think you're actually meant to go up here. I'm pretty sure you're meant to go up. Will I try the puzzle, or will I just, you know what? Ugh, it's a long run. I'm not sure I can, because I'm playing on PC, I can move a bit faster. Um, just run. Okay. All right, we're going to book it. Whoo! Yes! Whoo! I practiced at that a lot, fortunately enough. 
escaped from prison and are now on the run. Man on the run. Uh, all right. I'm going to age up. My depression is gone. <laughs> all right. Great. I was cured of depression. Look how happy he is. He still looks like an absolute mess, but he's very happy about it. All right. Uh, what are we going to do? I'm, I'll go into a random one again. Activities. Once again. All right. Yeah. Yeah. Activities will do it. All right. What's the choice? Start poll. What are you thinking? Plastic surgery would be a great idea, but we have no money. <laughs> so that's a little bit of a problem when it comes to plastic surgery. We got to be less ugly. I mean, you could also go to the gym and stuff if you want to do that. We don't have to resort immediately to uh, the gym. You, you're trying to do crime again. Okay. You're mixed between crime and love. <laughs> He really has a love-hate mentality, doesn't he? <laughs> Imagine the thought process of this human. Like, it doesn't really seem to make any sense. It's like, hmm, I have the sudden urge to either meet the love of my life or commit various crimes. <laughs> All right. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Okay. Love. Love wins again. Okay. What choice? Start poll. Date, dating app, gay dating app, or hookup? Threesome is not an option. I don't really know why. Maybe you have to be in a relationship on the game? I don't know. Alright. So, it's looking clear that it will be a gay dating app. Alright. Let's see. Oh no, I forgot there was options. Oh, we don't have enough money! Okay, that's off the agenda. Sorry, we, we have literally no money because instead of getting a job, you wanted to murder. Does this also cost money? That also costs money. Does this... Oh, no, 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 no. One second. I, I don't want to do that. Okay. So your options are actually one or four because the other ones cost money. Um, so one or four. What are you thinking? It's looking like four. <laughs> I really thought it would be one for some reason. I thought when you went down the love route that you actually wanted them to find someone. I don't know whether for love or to murder them. Again, he seems to be 50-50 on both of them. <laughs> but it's looking like he's looking for a hookup. Okay. Uh, I pull. Uh, let's see. Stat pull. Yes or no? Uh, one night stand with a Kenyan girl named Ikeo G Gear, is it? Sorry, my pronunciation is quite bad when it comes to most things. One or two. Okay, that's a clear one. Hook up. Oh, no. <laughs> There's even further choice. Okay. No condoms are available, and it looks like she has some craziness going on down below. <laughs> what will you do? <laughs> One or two, folks. Ha, <laughs> huh, I, I can see the one bear is flying up. Okay, then. Keep going. Worry later. No. She did not enjoy it, just to keep you up to date. Uh, your friends say that you look more relaxed the next day. Okay, that is a lie. Not because I look relaxed, but because he doesn't have any friends. Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, so after that glorious one night stand that you just had, uh, notice how I've pivoted now from calling the person me to you. You have swelling issues. <laughs> your throat is a bit sore, and when you feel your neck, you discover that your lymph nodes are really swollen. What will you do? It doesn't bother me. Go to the doctor, pray, or search the web. I don't know why you're saying pray, because if there is a god in bit life, I don't feel like... They will want to help us after all we've done. Who is up there looking down on us? Our dad, who we didn't go to the funeral to? Our stepdad, who we killed and then went to the funeral to, to laugh at? The dog, maybe? That could be it. Alright, maybe we're praying to Jackpot. Okay. Pray. Pray the pain away. I prayed that I would feel better. Okay, age up. 
You just woke with a blistering fever. What will you do? One, it doesn't bother me. Two, go to the doctor. Three, pray. Four, search the web. <laughs> We're praying again, aren't we? We're putting our, our, our life in Jackpot's hands. Okay. Have a little pray there. I pray that I would feel better. Okay, let's see. Let's let's go with occupation this time. This this menu. What are you thinking? I just want to see. Actually, I'll leave it up. I'm curious what's in special careers, but I don't know what it is. Okay, do you want to go get some education? A freelance gig? Bear in mind, we're a wanted criminal for murder, and we could likely be sent to death row if we get caught. So, think carefully about what you might want to do here. It might be best to do something a little bit on the side, you know? We just need a little bit of money if we want to progress in life. You know, get some, um, get some plastic surgery, change our looks entirely, escape the law. Okay, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Special careers you want to look in. This isn't going to work, is it? Oh, no. <laughs> oh, no. I didn't know this was even here. Okay, what would you like to do? Musician? Organized crime? Political office? Political office, organized crime, same thing, huh? <laughs> Ooh, uh, sorry, I'm trying to distract myself from the depression. <laughs> what are you thinking? Organized crime, okay. <laughs> What what organized crime are we gonna try and get into? The Irish mob, the Latin mafia, the mafia, Russian mafia, the triads, or the Yakuza? We've already been doing disorganized crime, so I mean we do have experience. At least there's that. The Irish mob. Surprise, surprise. Good choice. Pick your method. Try to join your local Irish mob syndicate today. Notoriety is half. Is that their notoriety or mine? And we want to join the O'Malley family. How are we going to try and impress them? We can wash cars. Ask straight out if we can join. Uh, relay messages. Deliver baked goods. Do yard work or deliver packages. I don't know what would work here. It just seems like seems like a risky strategy you know to get involved with organized crime when we're on the run at the moment and it's not like we've ties to them we're trying now to get involved <laughs> okay we're going to deliver baked goods hey uh, can i join your mob i uh make a mean donut and i'm also on the run for murder i just escaped death row <laughs> good donuts though try to join them well, I'll be damned, it actually worked. <laughs> he successfully joined the O'Malley family as an associate after breaking, after baking an array of sweets and treats for members of the family for two months. We're an associate of the Irish mob in Columbus, United States. Our calling card is a broken Guinness bottle and our rival is the McLaughlin family. Great. Do I get money? Alright, I'll age up anyway for now. Okay. This is an interesting one. I've never done this before. Really interesting. I like this. And lately, you've noticed the same page Volvo outside Family Skipper. Lucky Duffy's favorite restaurant. You feel you should investigate as it could be the feds. What will you do? One, tell the boss. Two, check it out. Three, blow it up. Or four, and nothing. The car could be abandoned. It could be literally like someone just shopping. <laughs> do we really want to... We do really want to. Okay. Blow it up. Muscle pain. <laughs> That's the concern. Recently. <laughs> recently. We have been uh, aching a little bit. Did we get no consequences from blowing up that car? Uh, in addition to that, you've also discovered a festering sore on your genitals. It doesn't bother me. Go to the doctor, drink a smoothie, or search the web. Okay, so I have come to the conclusion that your only remedies for any illness or ache is praying or smoothies. 
I like it. Drink a smoothie. I drank a smoothie and hoped for the best. God, quite the day, isn't it? Oh my god, we've 30 grand! Gang! Alright, sorry. I shouldn't be saying gang, given we're an organized crime. Probably a sensitive topic. Um, folks. What activity would you like to do? Now that we've got tons of money. I'm gonna scroll down a little bit. Um... Let's see, I'm gonna go to this one. All right, just to try and mix it up a little bit. I didn't really look for anything specific there. What are you thinking? What do you wanna do? We got 30 grand in a failed democracy. What are you thinking? Oh no, you're going to the horse races. A lawsuit, we have no one to sue, so I don't think we can do a lawsuit. Define your identity, I'm not sure what that one is. Um. Hmm. Oh, sorry. Tired. Okay, it's a close one. It's between horse racing and identity. Uh, five, four, three, two, one, finish. Okay, it's identity. Um, okay, I mean, this might be a good call even for just escaping the cops kind of thing anyway. What are you thinking? One, two, or three? Change your name. But at the same time, isn't it raising suspicion at the same time? I don't know if this is more likely to help us get away or it's going to raise suspicion. But I guess we're committed now. There is no going back in a failed democracy. <laughs> what are, he's got such a good name, though. What are we going to change it to? All right, name change. File a request to legally change your name today. What are you thinking? Working democracy. <laughs> okay, I mean it is working out. Maybe that does make sense. Uh, working democracy. For feck's sake. All right, this this won't really throw them off or or, or send, will it? All right, file request. It's been approved by the US government somehow. Your mother is arguing with you because you changed your name to Working Democracy. You literally named me a failure. You branded me a failure. You set me up for failure. And when I finally get involved with a group of like-minded individuals who happen to like the same things, blowing up cars, then you get pissed off that my life is working out. Argue back? Damn right, chat. Argue back. Shut up. <laughs> you argued with your mother. I'll have you kill next. <laughs> I did it to bro and I'll do it to you too. <laughs> For God's sake. <laughs> Working democracy. He doesn't look very happy. All right, let me see what else we got in here. Jesus, I'm starving. Can he pick the option in the poll that says for me to eat? Um, What do we got down here? All right. Okay, those are kind of irrelevant. Yeah, how about... How about those ones? Those are some interesting ones. Start poll. What would you like to do? You want to kill kill mom? Well, that's not an option right now. It'll be an option soon. And then you can try it. But, like, we got a good thing going. What are we doing? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Plastic surgery. I thought that might be going. And honestly... Not a bad idea. But what type of surgery would you like? Botox, eyelid surgery, facelift, gender reassignment, liposuction, nose job, penis enlargement, or a tummy tuck? Remember, they look awful, so anything will help. I see Liam there voting for penis enlargement surgery. Thanks for your contribution, Liam. Appreciate that. Thank you very much. Alrighty then. Penis enlargement surgery it is. Now... They're pretty close in reputation, but who would you prefer to go with? Um, like, you'd imagine they're both good. They're both in the green. But when it comes to plastic surgery, obviously, it's a very important procedure. And you're voting two. Okay, that's fine. You know what? That's a good strategy, too. You know why? Because if the surgery fails, we can sue them. You're onto something. I like that. Dr. Goldfarb, uh, I assume you want to go ahead with it to get the surgery. Ow. It is botched. 
You get what you pay for, chat. You see what I mean? You see what I mean? I'm going to I, I'm going to go into the sue menu because I assume I assume mm, that you want to sue him. So I'm going to go in there and I'll uh, I'll just fi find a law firm and then you can pick what we're going for. All right, let's sue him. Remember, if you go absurdly high, it's unlikely to work. We've got about twenty four grand to. Um, pick our, our legal defense. So we can't afford the best legal defense or offense. I'm not sure going into the courts is a good idea when I'm still wanted for murder. But oh well. We're going for a nice middle ground. I like that. Very sensible. Very sensible. There are a few people voting for one million dollars. <laughs> but uh, we got it in the middle, I think. I think that's a good call. Um, and now, what what team would you want? One to three. Um, the Ass Vogel and Henderson is the best one. You can see it on the screen there anyway. The most expensive one are the best. We changed our name, we'll be fine. That's true. <laughs> Grow a mustache, change your name slightly, not even your second name, and you should be fine. Three? Okay. We're going with three. You won! We won $100,000. Great job in the courts, everyone. You did fantastic. And we, we didn't get arrested or anything. Now we have tons of money. All right, what do you want to do with all of this money? Um, will I... Do you want more surgery? I'll give you the option. Shopping is also there if you want that option. So let me see. What do you want to do? We can, uh, we can look at vehicles and stuff next if you want. After this menu, we'll look at it. We'll age up and then we'll look at, like, vehicles and stuff. Um, let's see. One, two, three, four, five, six. So it's caught between love and surgery. Love is always weighing on his mind, isn't it? Love is winning. You know what they say. Love is blind. Yeah, I think love wins. Love. And we have enough money now. If you want to, you can do any of these. One through four. What are you thinking? We need a license. That's true. <laughs> we do. We, we do. Yeah, we, we failed our, our driving test because we thought it meant skinny cars only, which does make sense if you think about it. I hate when road signs body work shame. It's just not right. Okay, three. Okay, what's our desired age? I'm gonna assume... Okay, you you can just put in whatever number you want here, and I'll scroll down. So whatever number you want. One, two, three, four, five, six, and then the next sections are seven and eight. So whatever you think. Would you look at that? Eight. <laughs> That's going up fast. Do you think anyone even wants... To be with someone that young, like, will we find anyone? I mean, try it anyway. And, oh, it's, God, there's a lot of options here. Okay. Who are we looking for? For working democracy. I almost call them failed democracy again. It's hard. I've known him all his life as failed democracy. What are we thinking, folks? One through six? Is it one, two, three, four, five, six, six? One through six... Your choice. I can't believe this is a hundred dollars. What a premium app. Thinking. Jesus, this one's going very close. One, two, three, four. Four, I think. It's oh uh, yeah, that four's gone out in front. Okay. So we're looking for a non-binary 80 plus year old. Let's try. Search. Oh, it found someone who's actually interested. Okay. All right. Ol Olivia Cortez. So we can try again if you want, or we can just go with Olivia here. One or two. She's a retired trucker. Modern home. She's got looks, smarts, money, and ain't all that crazy. She would truly be, or non-binary. Would that be they? They would truly be our better half. What do you think? One. Oh, God. You, you really like Olivia. Uh, 
go on a date. You are now dating Olivia! Oh my god. And their looks are still awful. Oh no. Alright, well... Olivia's still fine with it, so that's grand. As long as Olivia's happy, we're happy. It's time we age up. It's been a busy year. We spent one year just crying. <laughs> this year had a lot. We gotta hit the gym for Olivia. Oh, we got- wait, you- oh my god, the chat is so divided. Half of you are like, marry, and the other half are saying, kill. You've been ordered to report to the family what you do. You see, now you should be starting to get a bit attached to this life. Like, there's a lot to lose here if we don't go. But potentially, if we do go, maybe they'll kill us. What would Olivia do without us? Without a working democracy, Olivia is nothing. No, it's definitely the other way around. Definitely. Definitely. Okay, we're going. Oh, Jesus. Oh, no, no, no. Gang, this is bad. Sorry, not gang. Uh, folks, this is bad. If you don't step up your earnings, you'll be stepping into a pair of cement boots. We didn't contribute anything. On top of that, we're experiencing hair loss. What do you want to do? It doesn't bother me. Go to the doctor, take some aspirin, or search the web. Oh no. <sighs> We're gonna take some aspirin. Okay, it's always three, isn't it? I mean, it is still useless. I don't know why you're taking aspirin for this. <laughs> Just, eh, it's medicine, it'll do something. So, what do we do with our job here? Irish mob associate. Um... Oh no, there's a lot here. Can we give them money? I don't really understand how this works. So do we do crime? Is that how we get money? Or can we just kick up some money? Does anyone know in the chat? How to do this? The relationship is very low. Uh, generate income. Oh, okay, there we go. Okay, this is probably a good idea. We probably have to do this. So I'm going to assume you want to. What would you like to do? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. There's eight options. How convenient. <sighs> Gotta earn some money. You're leaning towards a bank robbery or extortion. Or robbing a train. The train robbery one almost never works. I think it actually depends on what time it is in real time. So uh, I, I think we can kind of discount that one. Because I can tell you with confidence it will not work. It's a disaster. Um, extortion is the next one. Which probably is the best idea. Now it kills you? The train kills you? Really? Almost never works but the best payout. Yeah, but... Oh, yeah, it's extortion is winning now, anyway. But, uh... It's it's just... We'd end up having to come back into the menu repeatedly. Because it, like... It never, ever works. Like, I've tried it so much. Uh, extortion. Oh, God. Okay. Where are we going to extort, everyone? <sighs> Savings and loan, which is a bank. General Inc., Royalty Technologies, Sister Servants of Harry, a, con a convent, oh my god, Vitality Disco, or an inn. Why is there a convent there? Okay, you've picked a convent. It's kind of hip hypocritical to pray to God to solve all of your issues and then extort a convent, but okay. Um, oof. I'll try and do this in sections, so... You can pick. If I do one, I'll try and get 10% of the bar. If you do four, I'll try and get 50% of the bar and so on. So, vote whatever you think. I don't know how this is going to work. <laughs> we pray to the dog. Oh, yeah, sorry, sorry. I, I mixed up the letters. I was thinking God, but it's backwards. It's dog, yes. I don't pray to God. I pray to dog. What are you thinking? We got a lot at around the 50%, but we also got a lot at the everything. <laughs> so, I, I don't, on, honestly, I don't know how much money a convent generates, but I'm guessing it's not a whole lot, <laughs> to be 100% honest with you. <laughs> 
All right, you're thinking four. I think 50% has won. Okay. About there for 12,000. Okay, next start. Uh, it's, they refused. <laughs> what are we gonna do? <laughs> Never mind, shake her down, scare her, or whack her out. Just to, just so you're fully in the clear here, up on that red banner, it says none. And I understand she's having none of our shit, but still. Is it really? Okay, you're, you're gonna whack her, alright. We're whacking a nun. <laughs> whack her out. Are you sure you wanna whack the sister servants? Yes. Oh my god, even the cock of the gun. <laughs> All right, what do you think? What's your your choice of execution? The four horsemen, the pig pen, tank the trunk, a good wash, uh, the iron lady, or a wet cement burial? That is, yeah, that is it. I don't even know what some of these are. What's, um, the four horsemen? Well, um, uh, it doesn't say anything. I, I don't know what that means. I guess we'll find out whatever you pick. Oh, this is very divided. Jeez, you were very, very united in your mission to kill the nun. But how you do it is another story. You're thinking. Very, very divided on this one. But again, this is why it's a working democracy. Because one, two, three, four, five. The Iron Lady has won. Whacker. <laughs> You encased the sister servants of Harry Nunn in an Iron Maiden and left her to bleed out. She died. And I guess we've gotten away with it. How, how does he keep getting away with this? <laughs> oh my god. What a way to go. Um, okay, our, our standing has gone up a little bit. We have still earned them no money. So we might have to try again. What do you think? Look, I'll let you decide. How can I let you decide? I'll just go off the thing. What do you think? Crime? Crime? Do more crime? Okay, I, I, that clears it up. It wasn't very divided. You very much want to do crime. <laughs> crime. It's pretty neat. I like the organized crime thing, you know, except for the whole making nuns bleed out. But it's a neat little system, isn't it? <sighs> what are you thinking? Rob a bank. Extortion, Grand Theft Auto, uh, burglary. Yeah, you see, I think like the top four are the best. If we actually want to live. And I know you might be thinking, haha, let's get them killed. But think of Olivia. We have Olivia to marry and possibly kill. I don't know. It's hard to read the chat, like what exactly you're thinking. But we'd need an official poll. All right. And we're robbing a bank. This is dangerous. Olivia would not approve. Oh, sweet Jesus. Okay. I, I don't think this really matters, does it? That's it kind of irrelevant. Uh, what weapon would you like to use? Uh, to rob the bank. Malt off a cocktail, toy gun, a scythe, a spear, a pitchfork, or a bow and arrow? You're going with toy gun. I mean, it's not a bad idea. Scythe is right after it. That'd be a sight to see, right? All right, I think you're going with toy gun. Toy gun it is. Your disguise? What are you thinking for a disguise? How can we disguise working democracy? This won't work. I mean, you'd think maybe it could because they'd probably believe it's a real gun, right? Okay, one, two, three, four. I'm thinking of Minecraft helmet. I didn't even realize that was an option. Okay, we're wearing a Minecraft helmet. Oh, Jesus. Okay, what's our escape? A go-kart, a tandem bike on by ourselves? <laughs> a bus, electric scooter, or train? <laughs> 
<laughs> the Minecraft helmet with a toy gun. At least we can plead insanity after that, right? You don't have a car to get away. Well, it doesn't matter because this city is skinny cars only anyway. And that's too expensive. All right, what are you thinking? Four is winning the electric scooter. Okay, we're getting away on an electric scooter. <laughs> Rob it. You successfully robbed the bank with a toy gun while wearing a Minecraft helmet. You got away an electric scooter with $2,000. <laughs> you are collectively criminal masterminds. You've gotten away with two murders and a bank robbery wearing a Minecraft helmet. I'm honestly just impressed. <laughs> All right, where, where do you want to put the money? I personally think we should contribute the full amount to ensure that we live. Because I, I get it. It's fun to, like, don't report and keep it all and be greedy and stuff. But we don't want to die, do we? Like, we want to continue these hijinks. Okay, you agree. Seven people want to keep it all. <laughs> Finish the poll. That was pretty cut and dry. Contribute the full amount. Uh, oh, the family gave us back $218. Okay, is that is that enough? to give them our standing is still quite weak but like that should be enough right what if we just one second let me just say work harder you began working harder like uh, that just did that do anything okay it did go up let me just boost this up a little bit i assume you agree with this there's probably one person in the chat going i don't agree <laughs> stop <laughs> you're ruining it <laughs> okay it doesn't go up anymore all right, let's age up, shall we? You think more crime? Well, uh, we'll age up. We've done enough there, I think. Uh, your boss, Sybil, has ordered you to scare a detective who didn't detect she was in danger? Oh, okay. I get it. Uh, refuse to do it? Make up an excuse or do it? No questions. We n Yeah, we need to talk to Olivia. It's very important. We need to... We need to gift Olivia some stuff. Have some, like, movie time. That kind of thing. Alright. Do it, no questions. Oh, no. How will you rough up the detective? Oh, sweet Jesus. Okay. Oh, my God. What are you thinking? Rip his toenails off, punch his throat, break his nose, chop off his ear, slap his face, or kick his genitals. I, I, if only there was an option all of the above, I'm sure you'd be picking it. I'm sure you're like a kid in a candy store right now, and you're like, Ooh, I want to rip off his toenails and punch his throat. <laughs> oh. Where are we going with this? What's six? One, two, three, four, five. This kick his genitals is very close. Rip his toenails off, kick his genitals, and chop off his ear are all kind of neck and neck. Oh, they're very close. Okay, I'm just going to do a countdown. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Stop. Okay, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. Yep, kick his genitals. Shake him down. You kicked the detective's genitals. All right, well, that worked. We should really talk to Olivia or something. Okay. What do you think for... What do you think for Olivia? Start the poll. That's a thumbnail right there. <laughs> I like your attitude. Good thinking. Okay. How can we win Olivia's heart? I like how many of you voted for asking for money. <laughs> Compliment? Okay, compliment. Oh, yay! Okay, that worked. Let's try that again. Okay, and I'll well, scroll down here. There's some more. I'll do three, three, uh, three options with Olivia, so we can try and get this uh, this relationship on the road. It it might be good to at least attempt a marriage at some point. I don't know if now is the best option. It's just Olivia's pretty old and Olivia has a lot of money. 
eh, working democracy needs a lot of money. And unfortunately, this working democracy doesn't generate any taxes from the people. Unless you count all the crime, which we did steal from the people. Hmm. All right, what are we going for? Six, one, two, three, four, five, six. Make love. Okay. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. oh no. Oh, no. I forgot. We, <laughs> we had an STD from earlier. Why would you do that? You just gave Olivia syphilis. I don't feel like Olivia's just gonna be like, that's fine, and have a little prey. Don't worry, dearie, I'll make you a smoothie. <laughs> You'll feel fine, trust me. Oh, no. What do you want to do? Do you want to argue back? Or do you want to apologize? <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> what do you think? You forgot? I don't know. I feel like some of you might have forgotten, but some of you didn't. I wasn't here. Okay, well... You, you have an excuse then. Um, <laughs> to be fair, we did try praying it away, so... I, it's God's fault, really, when you think about it. Apologize. What's a relationship now? I said I'd do one more. And the relationship is not good. Olivia has a permanent pissed off face. Oh my god, Olivia has 1.1 million. Okay, well I did say I'd do... Three, so I guess I'll put it here. Start poll. What do you think? <laughs> I can't believe that. Olivia's 85. <laughs> we... I was gonna say we did Olivia dirty, but that is poor phrasing. <laughs> Okay, you're thinking. I can almost hear the Jeopardy music. Five, four, three, two, one, boom. Eight, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, gift. And you get to decide the gift as well. Start poll. <laughs> one, two, three, four, five, six, okay. We could give the wilting sunflower if we want to save some money. Say it's a sign. Like, uh, it's symbolic of a relationship. Uh, three, you're thinking Rolex. Okay. I'm willing to roll with that. Okay. Do you like us again? Did that make it better? Okay. I gave you syphilis, but I also gave you a watch. So, at least now you know the time. Oh, look at that. It's time for my syphilis medication. <laughs> See? <laughs> Olivia's like, you know what? You're not so bad after all. <laughs> okay, so that didn't go so well. You think we go to the doctor? Get rid of STD? Okay, I'll give you I'll give you the option. I'm not like just going there, but I'll give you the option of doctor. So doctor is there. Um what else have we got? Okay, and let's do another poll. Start poll. What do you think? Do you want to go to the doctor? See, I, I had a feeling that it might create some uh, division between everyone voting here. Putting crime on the agenda as well. And it has to an extent, but no, you do really want to go to the doctor. I'll give you a few more seconds to really make up your mind. No, you, you want to fix this. Okay, visit the doctor. Oh no, but what kind of doctor would you like to go to? Oh no. No smoothies for now. It's like, I don't understand. I select the doctor, but smoothie bar isn't one of the options. <laughs> you want to just go to a regular doctor? Okay, I like that attitude. Do you want to go to Dr. Hardwood or Dr. Romo's? In hindsight, we probably should have gone to Dr. Hardwood for the penis enlargement, but... Look, it worked out okay. We got a good settlement. Who would you like to go to? Dr. Hardwood or Dr. Romo? 
You're thinking Dr. Hardwood. Okay. Finish poll. Do we treat the syphilis? That's all that's wrong with us, surprisingly enough, other than, you know, that violent tendency. Did we get cured? You are no longer suffering from syphilis. Isn't that nice, huh? All right. Let's see. Uh, what should we do at work? I feel like we have to maintain work a little bit. Poor Olivia. Ah, Olivia will be fine. 85 with syphilis. It's nothing. Nothing. I think it was all the smoothies. I mean, it could be a coincidence. We took the syphilis medication, but the smoothie hit in at the same time. Or maybe... What was his name? Jack Jackpot. Up in the clouds finally got to our, our prayer. Okay, you want to do... Oh, yeah, I think what you mean is this. Yeah, sorry, I should have been more clear because these are also menus. But I'm assuming you mean crime when you say two. So I'm going to do that. Okay, what choice? I could probably go right into the crime menu most of the time. I assume that's what you want to do. Uh, do you want to do another bank robbery? A burglary? Extortion? Grand Theft Auto? Pickpocket, Porsche Pirate, Shoplift. And I won't do train robbery because it'll just end us, our lives, most likely. You want to do a burglary, huh? Okay, sounds good to me. Burglar home. <sighs> I mean, it doesn't really matter, does it? I'll give you the option. No, there's no point. I'll just go after anyone. It's, it's all the same. Okay. I will give you the choice, though. Of one to four. So, one, I steal one item. Two, I try for two. Three, I try for three and four and whatnot. Oh, God, I sorry, I ended the poll prematurely as soon as I started. So, however many items you think we should go for. Uh, if we get caught, we will likely go to jail where we could face the death penalty, by the way. Just because... Oh, it's actually... There's five things. My apologies. There's five things. So, we could get up to five. Um, probably too late for that now anyway, but... I think I measured three as winning anyway, so... Yeah, let's try... Let's try for three. Okay, I gotta plan out my route here, but... Okay, let's just wing it, because they're gonna... They don't have any dogs. That's the good thing. Not bad. Pretty successful. Ooh! Nice! Look at that! Nine... Uh, well, ten grand in cash. Pretty much. And the pawn shop gave you almost five grand for the stuff. Okay, I assume you just want to give all the money to the family. They, they must like us now. Look at that. Oh, that's our schedule. Hold on. We're working a 40-hour week, apparently. Um, okay, our standing's pretty good. Earned a bit of money. Good job, chat. Good choice. It's a job. Fertile ground. What choice are we going to go for? Um... Joseph informs you there are too many bodies at the family's usually dumping ground. He asks you to come up with a creative way to cover up the fact that there are so many bodies in one place. What will you suggest? One, build a plant a garden. Two, build a pool. Three, build a gazebo. Four, build a pasture. Oh, then you could say to the, the like, nuns that we've been killing, uh, I have to put you out to pasture. If you had the pasture, but... You know. I guess we could come up with, um with a pun for everything really is that echoing could be like for the garden ah uh, you're gonna be pushing up posies see you know you get me we could have a pun for everything all right let's plant a garden how pretty no olivia what are we gonna do olivia wants to break up what should we do <laughs> what are you thinking I can't believe it. Olivia. We gave you everything. Including syphilis. And this is how you repay us. <laughs> Beg Olivia to stay. Okay. We got dumped. Okay. That's fine. Okay, I'm gonna go into the activities menu, and you can pick uh, you can pick whatever you're thinking. Just thinking, you might want revenge. Is all. 
Remember, we're still wanted for murder, so just be careful what you pick. <laughs> or don't be careful, it's entirely up to you. <laughs> we do, um... We do have Hitman money now. Just saying. Pick crime. Uh, okay. What choice? Remember, the grey still counts, so the grey one is three, for example. Embezzle funds from work. Yeah, that probably wouldn't be a good idea, given the line of work we're in. <laughs> Oh no, what are we gonna do? It's looking like Hitman. Hitman or murder? I think Hitman worked. Okay, Hitman. Uh, I'm. You want to kill Olivia. I mean, that's pretty obvious, right? I, I'll, I'll put the poll in anyway, just so that I have, like, an out if I have to go to court over this. It's like, well, it was the chat, really. I didn't want to kill anyone. <laughs> Uh, let's see, one, two, three, four, five, so, Olivia's three, oh yeah, look at that bar shooting up, ah, uh, you love to see it, ah, <laughs> oh, you smell that, the smell of a murder pole, <laughs> Olivia, it's time for you to be pushing up posies, pushing up daisies, pushing, we're gonna kill you, <laughs> look for a hitman, higher, Oh no, they were an undercover cop! Chat, I've told you- Brendan, can you believe they're like this? Honestly, I was saying to them we should just kill them. Or maybe not kill anyone is what I should say. I was saying we should just not- we should not kill. But they wouldn't listen. Like, what can I say, you know? What can I say? <laughs> we're going to jail. It was rigged from the start. <laughs> we learned it from you. Look, do as I say, not as I do, okay? <laughs> Alright, well, what are we gonna do, folks? We got... We got caught. Do we want to cooperate with the authorities or resist arrest? Remember what happened last time we ran? We got put on death row. We're resisting arrest, okay. We don't really learn. I guess we never faced consequences for our action. Like, if they had killed us, we never would have done that again. We would have learned our lesson. <sighs> okay. Well, we're gonna age up once in here. We're depressed. That's not too surprising. Um, we can see here. What choice would you like to make? We got a shorter sentence. Yeah, I'm not sure why, because you'd think it would stack. Maybe they haven't realized where failed democracy. <laughs> Gotta remove the fake mustache. <laughs> I was failed democracy all along. <laughs> what are you thinking? Five, one, two, three, four. Oh, we're going right for the escape. No crying this time. I like that. All right. Escape it is. Boom. Oh no, they're standing in the way of the door. I might actually have to try and solve the puzzle here. Oh no. Oh no, 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 no. Okay, wait. Come down here. Oh no. Wait. I need you to go up here. And then across. What? Wait, no. I think I might have to make them come up here. Do I? Oh, that's scary. That they're, I can never outrun them, can I? Wait. Okay, I'm gonna try. <laughs> ah, feck! Try again next year. <laughs> it's our... Oh, no. <laughs> okay, well, we'll try to escape again next year, but in the meantime, while in the showers, you bump into a fellow prisoner named Einstein who was busted for first-degree murder. What will you do? His craziness is off the chart, by the way. Do we attack, insult, ignore, or compliment? Oh. <laughs> I feel uncomfy. It's actually... Oh, actually, compliment is taking off. The only person you're nice to is a crazy killer called Einstein. Hey, you know what? Criminals need love to compliment. That's a weird compliment. <laughs> and it's weird that you, uh, 
You first say, I mean it, and then you say he's a god. That's kind uh, of a- Ow! What? I didn't even click yet. Hold on, I wasn't ready. I got attacked while I was monologuing. <laughs> I was just about to say it's a weird kind of insult in a way, because our god is a dog, so we basically just call him a dog. But anyway... Okay, so I told Einstein that he's a god, he attacked me, and he stomped my foot. We're now depressed, our health is in the gutter, and we look like trash. We're very intelligent. I don't know what scale that's measured on, because every choice would imply that we're not very intelligent at all. <laughs> Jeez, we're only 29 years old. <laughs> I wonder... Did we... No, we didn't kill Olivia, so Olivia's still going strong. Jesus. Okay. Here we go again. Oh my god, our behavior's so bad. Running from the police, murder, felony escape. 44 years left in our sentence. I don't think we'd make it. Uh, right, what are we doing next, chat? Are we going to attempt to escape again? If only Olivia was still in the picture, huh? We could get that conjugal visit, finally. Okay, we're going to attempt to escape. Hopefully we'll get an easier one this time. Ooh. Okay, I think I can do this. Shit. Okay. They're going to move down. I'll move up. Okay. I'll try this. Oh, I wasn't even clicked on it. Oh, Jesus. The panic. Okay, up, up. Oh, no. I don't like it. Uh... Run, 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 run. <laughs> just take off. They made eye contact and then he just bolted. <laughs> Oh, it was like a deer or a rabbit or something. Just a quick look and then just gone. Okay, escape from prison and on the run. What's our first call of action, everybody? We have money. Do we want to get some plastic surgery, perhaps? I'll leave that in the options. But there's plenty of other things if you don't want to go that way. You can go whatever way you want. Whew. Jeez. Uh, right. Okay, it is looking like eight. You do want the plastic surgery? All right, plastic surgery it is. Now, what type of plastic surgery would hide our identity? We can try and kill Olivia next, yeah. I think you might be onto something there. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. A tummy talk. One, two, three, four. Gender reassignment. Okay. You going with that? All right, gender reassignment it is. Which doctor are we going to use? One or two, one or two, one or two. One or two. One or two, one or two. You're going to use the good doctor this time? Okay. Yeah, I'm feeling it. I, I think that might be a good call. Get the surgery. It was successful. What's our name? We keep our, we keep our second name. What will hide our tracks? Unfailed, successful, liberty, cursed, failing, anarchy, semi, sus, failed, communist, wonderful, socialist, Average. The letter A. I kind of like that. So it's just a democracy. I kind of like that one. I like that a lot. That's creative. A. <laughs> now we're not making a statement one way or the other. We're just saying we are a democracy. Which we are. This is A. <laughs> Alright. <laughs> That's A job. Oh, oh god, I got scared there. The skipper of the O'Malley family, a Lucky Duffy, passed away. Okay, I don't really mind. New skipper, that's fine. And our depression is cured. 
Turns out the skipper was the problem all along. Okay, let's see. I'm gonna give you an option that has crime in it. Because I'm kind of assuming you want to do some crime. I just have a feeling that someone out there has a target. You know? I think we're all thinking the same thing. We're just not willing to put uh, put it into words. Oh, no, no. Jackie Soraya just did kill Olivia. Okay, well, you said it out loud. That's the part where you're supposed to go, like, you know, be very shady, organized crime. You don't just say it out loud. All right, crime it is. Do, the question is, really, do you want to do the hitman route? Or do you want to murder Olivia ourselves? You don't, You never know, because there's a good chance we'll get caught if we do the murder. But the last time, the hitman option didn't really work out, did it? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. It was between five or seven. You're going for the murder. Okay, we'll do this with our own bare hands. I think you're not even too concerned about going to prison. You just want Olivia dead. That seems to be the vibe I'm getting. Uh, right, I'll pick Olivia because we kind of know that's what you're going for. And these are the options. Scare to death, impale them, bear trap, fastball to head, drive by, which is an odd one since we don't have a car, or push downstairs. Maybe we could drive by on that electric scooter from earlier wearing the Minecraft helmet. <laughs> I think we're just like doing some cosplay or something. <laughs> To be fair, yeah, you are right. We do have a good track record of getting away with murder. It's when we get other people to try and do it. It didn't work out. Do you want to do a bear trap? Is this like Looney Tunes or something? <laughs> okay, bear trap it is. Commit the murder. Oh, no. You dug a bear trap outside your ex Olivia's front door and the police were called. <sighs> Olivia escapes. Olivia, come on! Are we going to cooperate? Or, okay, there's no point in even polling. It's already flying off the chart that we're resisting arrest. Okay. Another year in prison, another year of depression. Are we going right for the escape this time, or are we going to have a cry again? The first time we went to prison, we went for a bit of crying. We had a year of crying, which was kind of nice. It was soothing. I Luckily, no one saw us, but... Now, I think we're used to prison. We're beyond crying. Yeah, there's a few people who want a nice little cry, but for the most part, you want to escape. Oh, sweet Jesus, this is a big one. Um, oh, God, I don't know if I'm even going to be able to do this one. They, they're getting more elaborate. Um, okay, I think... Okay, I think... Hmm. Yeah, I think that's my best shot. That was close. Let's do some crime. <laughs> I have a feeling that you have a vendetta that you want to really... At this point, Olivia deserves, like, witness protection or something. Okay, the only question is, do you want to try and kill or uh, get a hitman? There was seven. You're going right for the kill. Okay, I support that choice. And now how do we do it? Olivia? Okay, you got to go for something solid here. Because I'm worried that Olivia will die of natural causes, which would just be horrible. Like, you'd hate to see that. You would really, really hate to see that. Olivia dying happy, age 95 or whatever. What are you going for? Five is doing quite well. One, two, three, four, five. I thought you were going for bear trap again. I was like, really? Another one? I'm going to put it at the back door this time. <laughs> All right, push off cliff. Commit the murder. <sighs> Olivia is dead. Olivia is dead, everyone. Good job. Fantastic work out there. And we seem to have gotten away with it. Fantastic work. Uh-oh. 
Was that a menu sound or was that a shotgun being pumped? Because it sounded a little bit like a shotgun being pumped. Uh, do you want to report to the family or do you want to uh, avoid? <laughs> you want to go to the family? You want to report? I think that's fair. Oh, okay. Just a bit of a warning. My depression is gone. Whew. Okay. That's fine. Let's do some crime for the family. That didn't feel like it was going to end well. Family is everything. <laughs> Vin Diesel. Okay. What are you thinking? For a crime. The burglary went really well last time. Olivia was the problem. Olivia was the problem. We were distracted. It was nothing to do with us. I wish I could just donate money to the cause because we're earning a very good passive income here. Oh no, you want to do another bank robbery? Oh sweet Jesus. Oh wait, burglary is kind of catching up. I'll give you a 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, stop. Okay, we're going for a bank robbery again. I mean, it did work last time. Uh, I don't know. Oh, I think we're going back to the same... The same one as last time. They do say criminals always return to the scene of the crime. Pick your weapon. Bear spray. Why do we have all these bear related items? Do we have a phobia of bears or something? <laughs> bear spray, harpoon, ninja stars, pickaxe, slingshot, or hatchet. You're thinking harpoon? Yeah. <laughs> Pick your disguise. Oh no. Pick your disguise. Joker, Santa Claus, banker, ninja, monk, homeless person. That it? That is it. <laughs> Santa Claus with a harpoon? <laughs> really? <laughs> That's what you want? <laughs> okay. And what's our getaway vehicle? What is our getaway vehicle from this fantastic uh, attempted crime? A unicycle, a tricycle, a bus, a scooter, a rollerblades. A various mix of different amounts of wheels there. You got one, three, four, two, or eight, I guess, depending. Maybe, uh, maybe, what is it? Do they, the eight on the inline ones, or? I, I don't know. Um, anyway, you're voting for five, which is one, two, three, four, five. Rollerblades, okay. A rollerblading Santa Claus with a harpoon robs a bank. It sounds like the beginning of a very bad joke, and unfortunately the joke is our lives. Caught green-handed. What a surprise. All right, guy, do you want to try and cooperate with the or do you want to resist arrest? You want to resist arrest, don't you? Yeah, there you go. Okay, there goes Bob. Okay, all right. <laughs> Straight into jail. I mean, at this point, you may as well. The sentence isn't going to get much worse, is it? Okay. What do you want to do with our prison life? You'd think at this point the mob would want nothing to do with us. Like, we're just drawing attention to the family at this point. We keep getting caught doing these crimes. It's as if crimes are a bad idea. Uh, let's see. Bribe is pretty high this time, but I think overall you do just want to escape. Okay, escape. Oh, sweet Jesus. These are getting so hard. Um, oh, Jesus Christ. I didn't like that at all. That was a lot of pressure. Okay, a chop. Um, okay. Your boss has ordered you to shake down a drag queen for some reason. They couldn't lip sync, so we're pissed off. <laughs> I refuse to do it, make up an excuse, or do it, no questions. Do it, no questions. Honestly, I'm not sure what even question you would ask there. It seems just weird. Oh, God, here we go again with the awful choices. Rip her fingernails off, throw her out of a window, mace her face, smash toes with a hammer, dart her head, or nail her. Bit of a weird option there, the last one. Mace her face. Okay, we're going to mace her face. Uh, you've been experiencing some a 
abdominal bloating lately. On top of that, you're currently running a high fever. What will you do? Actually amazed we've made it this far, given what happened at the start. Like, the start seems such a disaster. We immediately jumped to murder. We took some time off from our school, from learning, just to murder. Two is winning, I think. We actually want to go to the doctor? What the hell happened to you? <laughs> I guess a democracy is maturing here. They're starting to become a bit more sensible. Go to the doctor. Uh, but which doctor do you want to go to? What clinic? Dr. Hardwood or Dr. Romo? Getting old. Yeah, you know, you got to look after yourself. You've grown attached to democracy now, haven't you? You want to even go to the better doctor. Oh, you are attached. Okay. Oh, it's diarrhea. I see. <laughs> Should I tell the stepsister? Like they told us? <laughs> okay, you're no longer suffering from diarrhea. Our health went up. How long have we had that? Guess it doesn't matter. Your mother is suffering from hemorrhoids. Jeez, we're a very open family, aren't we? Oh, sweet Jesus. We're getting involved with criminal stuff again. Uh, beat up one of the family's debitors with a blow-up hammer. Why a blow-up hammer? Why not a real hammer? Uh, what mob is this? You keep threatening to kill me, but I'm not as intimidated now. If you're doing the crimes with a blow-up hammer, do it, no questions. Probably for the best. Again, I don't even know what you'd ask. Okay. Um, okay, what is this? A new spa is offering a platelet-rich plasma treatment for its first 100 visitors. You feel like you could use an energy boost. What will you do? One or two? I don't like lines is the option for knowing you. You're taking very good care of democracy all of a sudden. Suddenly democracy matters to you, doesn't it? Okay, I'm gonna give you a job here. Well, I'm gonna give you a choice here. What do you want to do? Uh, should we... Or will we go to activities? Let's go to activities. Yeah, let's do our own activities for a change. Um, do we got anything in there interesting? Let's just... Let's go with that. And then we might go to the shop. <laughs> Gotta outlive Olivia by a lot. I don't think that's gonna happen. I really don't. <laughs> I like how the, the poll initially burst with accessorize, but then crime just starts to catch up. Oh wait, no, it's adoption, sorry. I That's not gonna work. We have a criminal record, so it's not gonna work. You'll have to pick something else. They won't give it to us. Oh no, Olivia's dead. Wait. Olivia is dead, right? Yeah, Olivia's dead. Yeah, yeah. Mm. You want to accessorize? I was thinking about adopting a child, but instead I decided to buy some accessories. It might be good for a disguise, honestly. I'll just go eyewear. Oh god. That, that's the only option. Okay, I'll just mix up both. I'm a mobster, see? <laughs> okay, we've accessorized. There wasn't many options there, which I guess makes it easy for me. Um, right. Uh, so the only one we're not going to do here is uh, Time Machine. Because that travels back in time, and I think it costs money. <sighs> Incognito mode activate. I mean, that pretty much is what it was. <laughs> Put on a little hat and some glasses. They'll never know it was us. You want to get a pet? Okay. Uh, I don't think... I I don't think... They'll allow us to uh, rescue an animal because of our criminal background. I might be wrong. Do you want to try and buy a cat? Or exotic pet? Oh no, exotic pet is taking off. Okay, exotic pet it is. Alright, we're getting a parrot. Probably a bad idea, given that I have so many secrets. The parrot's gonna start repeating everything I say. Uh, name... What are we naming the bird? Any good names for a parrot? Three, four, two... <laughs> that, is, that is a funny name, actually. I could call it two. Yeah. 
Oh, wait, no, you were voting. Okay. Bird, that's a pretty good name as well. Uh, communism seems to be the top spot. Can I paste? Oh, I can. Oh. This game has it all for the lazy man. The new Malko is now pronounced communism. Great. <laughs> Fantastic. Um, okay, for some reason... We have de-escalated hard. We were committing murders and what now and whatnot. Now all of a sudden, we're gonna do some graffiti, <laughs> or are we too busy? No, we're not too busy. We gotta spray paint over some ball as tags. Okay, we enjoyed it. I guess that's the important part. Assets, finances. Oh wait, I wanna go shopping. Shopping. Okay. What are you thinking? Um, we don't have a driver's license, so I guess I'll leave it on these options. Yeah, I, we don't have a driver's license. I mean, or you know what? I'll try and get the license for whatever you pick. So, there. Start poll. What are you thinking? Three. You want to shop for fake jewelry? Jeez, this is very balanced. Fake jewelry is an odd one, though. What are you plotting? I thought you'd want, like, a boat or something. I guess... It is kind of... Except, oh, four. Oh, you kind of want to buy property as well. Jeez, you can't decide what you want to buy. Okay, I'm just going to count down. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five. Four, three, two, one. Stop. Four. Property. Okay. Okay, we don't have that much money, but we can afford anything in that line. That's convenient. Okay. You get to pick what house we get. Oh, we can't actually afford the top one, but oh well. I'll leave it there now. I don't want to mess it up. Contemporary home, haunted colonial home, mid-century home, modern home, ranch style, row house, town home. What do you want? You want the haunted house. Okay, that's nearly all of our money, but fair enough. Spooky. <laughs> I Wait, do you want a mortgage or do you want to buy it with cash? You got to make some financial decisions here. Or one or two. buy it with straight up cash oh it's close a lot of you just want to buy it straight up in cash okay cash it is yep okay great uh, let's do one crime thing on behalf of our associates generate income for the family What do you think? We could have a house party. Yeah, now that we have a house, we could have a house party. The only thing we're missing is friends, which is more important, I suppose. Just because you have a house doesn't mean you can have a party. Like, if you have literally no friends. The guy you spend time with is a rat? Are they? How do you know? Or are you just guessing? Alright, we're doing a burglary again. I like that. Let's go with a doctor. It might be Dr. Hardwood. They got a lot of money, right? Okay, once again, we got... Oh, no, there's a dog. Okay, one, two, three, four, five items. How many would you like me to try and steal? Four, two, five, four, three, five, three, three... You're going with three. You're going very balanced. Oh, four and five are both going up. I think three. There's three people who want me to just rob one thing and leave. <laughs> okay, I think three has won it. Let's get three things. I guess the big wad of cash, anyway. Get this. So far, so good. There, gone. Ooh, look at that. That's a lot of cash. 17,000, almost 18. Oh my god, I almost clicked on don't report it and keep it all. Contribute the full amount. Fantastic. 
What? <laughs> Your boss has ordered you to scare a MILF who stopped texting the skipper. What will you do? <laughs> okay. <laughs> That's a little bit of a weird one. The boss has a lot of weird requests. They're always super weird, aren't they? They're never just normal. Oh, sorry, I messed up the poll. Okay, you want to do it. I mean, that makes sense. You want to do that. Okay. Uh, what do you want to do, though? I feel like we should do some extortion. I might do some extortion next. The Irish mob is weird. They really are. <laughs> They're... Very strange. Glue her lips shot. Okay, if that's what you want to do. You used a hot glue gun to adhere. Oh my god. Okay. And then go back to my job and we'll do an extortion thing. Uh, crime. Extortion. Um, you could pick who we're going to extort. What are you thinking? A bank, small business, corporate, uh, the convent again, <laughs> the nightclub. Where are we going? <laughs> Oh shit, I didn't start the poll, sorry. Alright. What are you thinking? <laughs> We're going back to the convent. <laughs> we really took that personally, didn't we, last time when they didn't give us the money. Okay, the convent it is. And now you're going to have to decide on the amount once again. The amount you pick uh, will be... Like, if you pick four, I'll try and get 50%. If you pick one, I'll try and get, like, you know, one-eighth, that kind of thing. So, whatever you're thinking. Four is flying up. I mean, last time we didn't get four. It didn't work out, but... Eight is going up quite high as well. You want to go for all of it? It's once again between 50% and 100%. I think 50% is going to win. Yep, we got 50%. Okay, that was... I'm going to go for the exact same amount. Years later, I come back. <sighs> really? Avery McQueen, you should really know better than this. Her fear is oh off the charts. Hope that didn't break anything. I just pulled on a wire. Uh, let's see. Start poll. What do you think? Shake her down, scare her, whack her, or just never mind. You'd be like, all right, fair enough. You don't want to give me the money. That's grand. And <laughs> we could just leave. You want to shake her down? Shake her down or scare her seems to be the top ones. Five. Four, three, two, one, zero. Okay, scare her. Oh no, what are we gonna do? These are pretty brutal. <laughs> Send her a package, trash her house, bust car windows, firebomb her house, slash car tires, or jump scare. <laughs> Just sent her that really old commercial back in like the mid 2000s with the car and then the thing jumps up and scares you. Like, hee hee, gotcha! <laughs> She's like, alright, alright, I'll pay! Don't send me any more of these memes! These old boomer memes! Okay, four. One, two, three, four. Firebomb her house. Seems like a measured response. Alright, we got two grand. There you go, mob. Thanks. Oh, there's a heist being planned. Uh, Spuds is... That's a horrible name for someone in an Irish mob. It's a bit on the nose. He's planning a heist that will allow family associate Charles Cheeks Borklet to hide in plain sight after he pulls it off. You are tasked with requiring a vehicle that will accommodate the plan. What will you choose? I mean, I can't feckin' drive it. Uh, but what do you think? A tractor? A laundry van? A riding lawnmower? Or a Zamboni? <laughs> I mean, the riding lawnmower might suit the Irish, to be fair. And two, a laundry van? Oh, God. Okay, I'm going to count down. Five, four, three, two, one, stop. All right, laundry van it is. Okay, did it work? Do we get any update? It wants to binge watch Sopranos. I'm assuming we're down for that. We enjoyed that immensely. <laughs> For God's sake. Okay, activities. What do we want to do? What do we got here? Uh, maybe there? What choices we got? They're a rat because they're sucking up to you. <laughs> Because we're watching Sopranos together. You'd think so? Like, I don't know how to do it. Should we do something a bit more creative with the, 
the family menu i might take a look you want to love okay but what should we do what should we do to find love huh what type of love are they looking for the gay dating app again all right let's do it uh once again just whatever age you want you can pick so just the higher the number you put in the older they will be essentially what are you thinking one i see a few ones in there oh a lot of ones actually a lot of ones and a lot of eights i think eights is winning again all right let's take a look at the golden oldies so and what are we thinking start poll I'll go into the the family menu after this, the the mob one. We might see what some of the other options are. Um, oh, this is the full menu. Okay, five, four, three, two, one. One female. Okay, let's try it. Okay, they're not crazy. At least they're ninety three. They got lots of money. All right. <laughs> Okay, gang, we need to impress them a bit more than last time, okay? Okay? What are you thinking? Ask for money? That's what you initially go for? Okay, that's plummeting. Okay. Compliment? Okay, go with a compliment. Okay. Okay, that did work. That worked. Now what? We'll we'll go again. Three three chances. So you you ease it up with the compliment. I like that. I like that a lot. I like how a few people are trying to insult her. <laughs> You're it's stuck between compliment again, conversation, or give money. You're trying to buy her love. Okay, fair enough. I mean, she has a lot of money already. Okay, so I'll just give her the 10 grand. I assume you will. She did like it, to be fair. Okay. She does really like us. Maybe that was a good idea. Clearly, I know nothing. Wait, gift? Oh, sorry. I picked the wrong one. But hey, it worked out anyway. So, <laughs> I mean, <laughs> it worked out perfectly in the end. <laughs> what do you think now? Um, sorry, I should be scrolled down. What are you thinking? Two, three, four, five, six. Six would be elope. You want to try eloping? Okay, let's try eloping. I hope you say yes, because we might end up murdering you otherwise. <gasps> We're eloping! Okay. Your mother is arguing. Our mother is still alive? Your mother is arguing with you because you got eloped without telling her. What will you do? I assume you want to argue. Shut up. Look at all of her money. Now that you're married, you're wondering if you should change your last name. Keep Mrs. Democracy. Change to Mrs. Morris Democracy all the way. Mrs. Morris. What do you... Th oh, shit. Sorry. Let's end the poll. What do you think? Oh, my God. Shit. Sorry. I ended the poll. What do you think? <laughs> Can we kill her mom? I'll give you the option. <laughs> change to Mrs. Morris Democracy. You're thinking Mrs. Morris Democracy. That's such a weird name. Okay, Mrs. Morris Democracy it is. You're now sharing assets with your wife, Briona. Is that how you pronounce that? I don't know. All right, we got another house and we got one million in cash. Look at that face. They're happy. They're finally happy. <laughs> a Morris Democracy. What does that even mean? <laughs> okay. Um, I'm going to give you an option with crime on the menu also the casino and the horse track so there's a few things you could pick there you don't just have to do crime we could double our money here on blackjack <laughs> whatever you're thinking i do understand you were very pissed off at mom though you know she's 96 so she'll be dead soon i mean yes <laughs> um, we're talking about the wife here by the way not the mom i think the mom's gonna outlive the wife <laughs> okay you're going with crime What crime do you want to do, though? 
I have a sneaky feeling that you're itching to do a bit of pickpocketing, are you? No, it's 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 not. It's not that at all. Okay. That's fine. Murder is just soaring. Okay. <laughs> all right. Murder it is, I guess. Yeah, murder's continuing to climb. Murder. Who do you even want to kill? Is it is it mom? Is that who you want to kill? Would you like to kill mom? You do seem to have it out for religious people, so I wouldn't be surprised if you just picked a random priest. Mom is... Oh, shit. One second. Let me just restart that poll there. So, mom is one, two... I'll just start it. Where's mother? Okay. I'll start it there. So, we have a few options there. Ex's husband. Or ex. Random priest. The wife. The sister. Or mother. What are you thinking? Six would be mother. Six. And wife is also doing quite well. I mean, quite badly, I guess I should say. <laughs> oh no, it's definitely mother. And how are we going to kill them? Impale them? Atomic wedgie? Elephant laxative? Drive-by? Strangle them or club them? We can't do drive-by because we don't have a license, unfortunately. It won't work. I've tried it before. All right, three, elephant laxative. You do come up with creative ideas. I feel like we're actually playing Hitman sometimes. Oh, God. You tried to sneak an elephant laxative into your mother's morning smoothie. She called the police on you. Resist arrest. I don't even need to do the feckin' thing. And then we, we try and escape. I know the routine now. All right. I think I can just run for it. Yes! All right, I'm out. Day job. It's been a while. You've been ordered to report to the family. I assume we report because we have been the whole time. Oh, no. We need to make more money. They're so needy. They're more needy than my actual family. Okay, we got to generate some money. What crime do you want to do? Honestly, the organized crime job is a tough one. Okay, thank you very much for the hype train. Don't feel like you got to do anything for it. Um, I'll get to the alerts uh, afterwards, after we're done. This failed democracy. I don't know, could you even call it a failed democracy? Because we are loaded. Like, this is one of the most wealthiest people I've ever had. Emigrate? You think we should emigrate? Maybe we should escape. We could try emigrating. You want to do a burglary? Okay. Uh, an accountant. Okay, and how how many? I guess three again. You probably want to do okay. Oh no, there are two dogs. Okay, there are two dogs. How many things do you want me to try and steal? Rat on the crime family. Yeah, I'll go into the crime thing, and we can we can see what's there because we are under their thumb at the moment. Two? You think two things? That might be a good call. All right, let's let's try and get two things. Oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no. Okay, I'm actually stealing a lot more stuff in the end. I was only going for two. Okay. Wait, I only got $1,000. Okay, you can take it all. <laughs> for God's sake. Abosha, thank you for the two subs. Space Kitten, thank you for the five. And Voxy, thank you for the five as well. I'll catch up with all of them in a while. Jesus, thank you very much. Appreciate it. Okay, let's see. Job. Oof. We might need to try something else because this thing isn't working out. What do you think? Should we try and escape the family? I'll do a poll. You can just pick more crime if you want. But I've started. I've started one to try and see what you want to do. Become an informant is winning at the moment. Become an informant is... Ahead of the game by quite a bit. Okay, we are becoming an informant then. <laughs> Contact the authorities and volunteer to become a confidential informant against the O'Malley family today. Yes. Oh no, once you provided sufficient evidence against the O'Malley family, you will be allowed to enter the witness protection program and be free of the Irish mob. You must not be caught committing any crimes during this period or your status as a confidential informant will be revoked. You have a maximum of four years to provide the evidence. 
Oh, okay. Case, how do I do it? I don't have any evidence. Uh, what do we do? I can't do any crimes, can I? Maybe I should hang out with the boss. The underboss, the skipper. Ask him out. Expose him as a rat? Can I expose someone as a rat? Okay, you know what? I'll give you the choice who we're going to interact with, and then you can pick what we actually do. So, start. Because I know you have it out for Charles. That would be a lot of projection. We have become a rat and immediately go, that man is a rat. <laughs> it's kind of like uh, drawing attention to ourselves. You want to talk to the skipper? Okay, we're talking to the boss man. What do you want to do? Do with the skipper. Quite a few options there. Uh, start the poll. What do you want to do? <laughs> Thank you again for the hype train, everyone. It's very kind of you. I'll get to all those alerts once we see how this democracy thing plays out. Ask him out? You want to ask out the mob boss? Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Or hook up with him. Oh, God. That's a close one. Okay. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Done. Okay. We're going to try and hook up. We don't have syphilis anymore, do we? No, we, we, we cured the syphilis. Okay, good. Looks very good. <laughs> I don't feel like this is going to work, but try to hook up. They rejected us. Oh, no, I've been ordered to report to the family. Oh, no. Your boss said he'd hate to see you get chopped. Oh, well, that's very nice of you. <laughs> I don't, like, read through the lines at all here. Okay, um... Let's see. So that relationship absolutely plummeted. In fact, most of them did. Who would you like to interact with next? He knows we're a rat. Uh, maybe we should accuse someone else then. <laughs> Apparently trying to hook up with a boss is, isn't a good idea. <laughs> we're married. Look, it's, it's the case, all right? It's not true love that we were going after that spud for. <laughs> it's just the case. All right, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Charles. Um, oh no, what are we gonna do? There's ask out, befriend, compliment, contract. You could put a contract on him, expose him as a rat, hook up. <laughs> what do you want to do to him? <laughs> Can we flee the country? I'll let you give you have that option after this if you want. Six seems to be winning. What's that? One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, we're going to expose Charles as a rat. Are you sure you want to expose him as a rat? Yes. You declare that he's a rat. Wait, was that correct? They verified that he is in fact a rat. Oh my god, how did you... How did you know? Was he just, like... Was it the, hey, let's watch The Sopranos together that gave it away or what? <laughs> It reminds me of the the, the get-up I had on in the unboxing stream. And it's like, hey, you, hey, you want to do mob stuff? Uh, you want to, like, uh, watch, you know, the entire series of Sopranos? I'm not a cop, by the way. <laughs> All right, well, he was put through a wood chipper. Now I've been ordered to report to the family. Time for a... No, oh, shook my head and nodded. There we go. That got us back in the good books. So you want to hook up or what? Standing's gone way up. Look at this. All right. What do you want to do now, folks? We're in everyone's good books. <laughs> Picked up on body language. A rat exposing a rat. Like, they told me not to get involved in any crimes while I'm an informant. And I just put a man through a wood chipper. Is that even a crime, though? I've never heard of, a, like, a law against that. So, I don't know. Uh, you want to interact with the skipper again? Okay, what do you want to do this time? <laughs> Start poll. <laughs> Ask him out is winning. And then befriend. 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 Compliment following behind. But no, befriend is winning. Alright, befriend. Befriend him. You've been ordered. How come anytime I even approach them, even if it's for good, they pump the shotgun? Oh, he didn't like that. Uh, he does not want to become our friend. Okay. 
We should have probably known that given that no one has ever wanted to become our friend. I don't know why we thought the boss of a crime syndicate would want to become our friend. Oh, we probably should have asked for that promotion. We gotta... Alright, let's age up, but we've got no evidence. Our wife died! <laughs> Alright, what, what are we doing with the funeral? One, plan her funeral. Two, go, but let someone else plan it. Or three, skip it all together. Oh, we got a lot of money. We can try and leave the country if you want. Okay, we're skipping it all together. All right. It seems to be a trend. You inherited cash assets of 534,000. Uh-oh. While on a trip to the mall, you are confronted by the captain from the O'Malley family. Oh, run for my life, attack him, attempt to reason with him, or beg for forgiveness. Oh no. Oh no, this doesn't look good. If we escape from this, we're immediately going to attempt to flee the country, I think. I'll give you the option anyway for sure. What do you think? Attack him? Oh, I kind of like that actually. That might be our best option. Okay, attack him. Oh god, I hope they don't have a gun. What if they're just coming over to say hello and we're overreacting because we're a rat and we're a bit jumpy? Okay, what do you want to do to him? Slap, headbutt, punch, bite, spit, grab? This is getting... This is getting intense. Emigrate. That's not an attack, unfortunately, but we'll try it afterwards. Alright, headbutt. And where do you want to headbutt him? His mouth, his toes, his skull, his stomach, his chest, or his jaw. <sighs> Headbutt. His toes? That's a weird attack. Is, are you sure? <laughs> That's what you want to go with? <laughs> the, okay. Uh, five, four, three, two, one. <laughs> okay. <laughs> We're going to headbutt his toes. Just like in the Sopranos. <laughs> I attack. You did a bit of damage. Uh, okay. That uh, that was a bit of an overreaction. We headbutted his toes and then he threw us into a pit of frenzied ravenous pigs and watched them consume us. Honestly? Not a bad. Not a bad run given that like... The way it started, we picked every single terrible option up until like the last few years where we tried to get some sense and actually stay alive. But we were in too deep at that point. When we got old, we saw the error of our ways and we tried to correct it. We had a big net worth. Three lovers, three murders. <laughs> See what I mean? He was caught between love and hate all the time. That is the story of his life. Uh, years in prison, five. A Morris democracy passed away at the age of 40. Her mother and her three sisters couldn't be bothered to attend her funeral. <laughs> I mean, that is kind of karma. An undisciplined woman. Friends say she was an abject and detestable person. <laughs> Good job, everyone. Pog. <laughs> Undo debt. No, no, that costs money. And plus, we, we don't get any second chances. This is real. You can't just undo it. Democracy is dead, everyone. <laughs> <laughs> Try again, that's A. <laughs> I like that. Alright, we're gonna call it there. Well, that was really fun. I hope you enjoyed it. It was just something a bit different as well, you know? It's good. It was suggested by someone, but I can't recall the username now. But that was fun. We gotta do more stuff like that. Like, super interactive stuff, I think. I finally lower my camera. It was too high. Um, right, gang, I got a, a, a few people to thank because you have been very, very nice. I very much appreciate it. Thank you very much. Um, okay, where, where even was I? Foxy, thank you so much for the, um, the five subs again earlier. I hope I'm in the right place. I think I am. Um, where was I? It went so far. Oh my god, it went so far, it's actually gone off the page. Holy shit. Thank you very much for all the support, everyone. Um, feckin' hell. Oh my god, there's so much. Um, Chris, Project, Kayla, Alectony, thank you so much for the five subs there. Steadfast, Glitter, Snacky, 
uh, Hedda, Duck Winters, Slamabang, uh, still, uh, still has bad memes, The Sparrow, Snake, Crucial, Brofan, uh, Satius, Aggressive Penguins, Pancake the Polite, Slavic, Atlas, Call Me Aaron, Geek, Pink, uh, Ch Cheshire Dragon, Snacky, Darkon, a Caster, uh, Kosh, Ronald, Jonah, Astillion, uh, That Lion Thing, Pepe, uh, Lucana, Trebo, Jesse, uh, The Real Jacronos, Orbital, Ban Wilco 0103, <laughs> um, Tarantula, The Blinding Light, Belton, His Father, Combat Katie, uh, Joe Kip, Dearest, NPC, Silent Still, uh, The Ultra Blood, uh, Sarah, Reaper, Happy, Toad, uh, Kship, Steel Roses, Samoth, The Apple Crab, Matt, Tarantula, Mark, Crycats, Eternal, Nuka Gula, uh, Cody, RJ Holy, uh, Little Tiny, uh, hey, it's a uh, it's a Avery, um, uh, uh Cookings, Raven, Anxiety, Anger there, a cheesy, uh, Crotalus, Waning, Romelia, a hot granny, Izzy. This hot granny is a fitting name given what we just did. Uh, Flungle, Dongle, Wongle. Thank you for the tip, and that is Hagrid and Brendan Fraser behind me as well. Imperial, thank you for the bits. Uh, Voxy, thank you so much for the five subs again. Uh, Majin. Uh, the Envy of Chaos, uh, Kaylee, Jerry, Doe-Eyed Sage, Unpronounceable Name, uh, Ragged, it's it's literally symbols, I'm sorry, I don't know how to say her name, Lonnie, Andrea, uh, Murr, That's So James, Crazy, uh, Symbols Again, I'm sorry, Little Wolfer, Artful, Necromancer, Unholy, KB, Kristen, uh, Licorice, Stump, uh, Hi I'm Scared, uh, Artil, uh, Big Old Goose, Christian, uh, Boopal, Killer, Danny, uh, O'Aaron, uh, Jojo, uh, Supermat, Deep Forest, Beach, Crimson, Satan, Ali, No Chances, Gravity, Chaos, Sig, Delta, Nitram, Deleted, Bosha, Slump Sloth, Jesus Christ, thank you for all the support, everyone. Pabli, uh, The Tiny Moose, Brandy, Insanity, Lightning Hook, Benefits, Pomegranate, uh, Awakened Waffle, Psysis, <laughs> this is insane, Jesus Christ, thank you very much. Just Marcel, um, Imperato, Super David, Danny, uh, Roxy, Infinite, Hobzo, uh, Harry, Rocket, uh, Eber, uh, Olivia, Hova, Sleepy, Government, uh, Falcon, uh, Madison, Queen, Hokane, Space, Atlas, Voxy. Thank you so much for the five subs. You're very, very kind. Thank you so much. Uh, Butterfly, Pocket, Truly, Candy, Space Kitten. Thank you for the five as well. Marijax, thank you for the bits. Bosha, thank you for the two. Uh, and we're on the last page. Jaina, Matter, Nexus, Blargy, Linu, Halo Blues, uh, Dance. Bosha, uh, thank you very much. Larissa, Elena, Trifolium, uh, The Rock, uh, Mischief, Taboo, Glitchy, Nanners, uh, Valve, Alien Boy Creation, Zombie, uh, Meg, Abu Kitty, Black, Fer uh, Fernie, uh, Legos Fairy, Sofa King, and Doggy. Thank you very much. Jesus Christ, thank you for all the support. <laughs> Feckin' hell. <laughs> very, very kind. Feckin' hell. Very, very nice of you. I, I appreciate it a lot, folks. Thank you so much. Um... I gotta put that file going. Whew. Jesus, that was a lot. Thank you so much for that. Um, I'll just put that going, that file, because I'm probably gonna make that into a video. So look forward to that, hopefully. Um, I hope you're looking forward to it anyway. <laughs> it should make uh, an interesting video. But Jesus, gang, thank you for all the support. That was feckin' nuts. Very, very nice of you. I, I very much appreciate it. Um, all right, uh, let me see. I might try and raid someone new. I think maybe a music streamer. That might be nice. Um, who have we got? Um, okay, I uh, yeah, I like that title. That's got me in. Okay, yep, yep, I like it. I like it. Um... How could I go to my... Uh, Voxy, thank you so much for the bits. And thank you for the kind words about the Sims 2 videos. Seraphie, thank you for the tip as well. Uh, Halo Blues, thank you for the bits. Uh, Cole, I don't forget who you are. <laughs> Sometimes it's just easier when there's a lot of names. Sometimes it's hard to, like, you know, get your brain working um, on all cylinders. Skosa, thank you for the sub as well. Uh, all right, let me... Where Where is my chat? There it is. Gang, thank you so much. Um for the support today and thank you for being so nice i hope you had a good time bit of a, a strange uh, stream but uh, i hope you enjoyed it i'll be back on saturday that's the plan anyway allergies permitting 
Um, I have a video going up in half an hour, Sims 4 one, that I think is pretty fun. You might like it. Um, I, uh, I appreciate the kindness, the support, just hanging out. And that's about it. We're going to send a raid over to a music streamer. I never looked at them before. I've never seen them before, but... Um, their title intrigued me because it was sings and chats and puns and I'm interested to see what puns we got going there uh, so I hope you enjoy that uh, I'll leave it on in the background for a bit but I am roasting and I'm starving so I gotta get some food and I gotta cool down um, but thanks very much for joining me and uh, I hope to see you next time bye 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 bye